And we are live. I think we're live. Good evening, everybody. Thank you very much for joining us for part two mm. of ISS Vanguard. First word I have for everybody, spoilers. Mm. We have played through the tutorial earlier on today. We've done the tutorial. We've done all the way through ship management up to the point where we're about to land on our second planet. So uh, even though I would have... Some people class the tutorial as a spoiler, but that's the first thing you're going to do when you play the game. Yeah, a bit of story, I guess, when you first start. Yeah, but, yeah. but everything from this point is going to be a spoiler. So if you're not worried about that, then feel free to, to carry on watching. Uh, we left where we were at the end of the mission launch procedure. We're strapping in. We are strapping in. Um, before we start, just a couple of things. First of all, this is not a sponsored video. This afternoon's was sponsored, but this one is not sponsored. Uh, so thanks very much to all of my Patreon supporters for funding the channel. And if you like the content that I create and you want to support the channel directly, you can do so at patreon.com forward slash gaming rules. Help us make more videos like this. Uh, and also, if you are watching this back afterwards, not live, but if you're watching this back afterwards, turn on the subtitles and change them to the Klingon channel. Because if anybody spots any mistakes that we make that we don't pick up during the game, uh, I'll add some Klingon subtitles in afterwards. Right, with that mm. said, I think I think we're ready to go. So, uh, it, again? it is... Well, I don't know. <laughs> what are we on? Log 315. Yeah. So, let's go in. This is us. 315. Off we go. Vanguard, this is the away team. We are en route to the designated landing zone. All systems nominal. Uplink stable. We should be past the outer layer of debris right about... Oh, wow. My God. You seeing this, Vanguard? Crystal clear, away team. It seems like the long-range scans were right. The planet is gone. If you see no clear approach vector, you have permission to abort. No, some pieces of the crust look large enough for a touchdown. And we detect anomalous structures among the debris. We could take a look. Anything you bring back will be invaluable, away team. Just don't bite off more than you can chew. There are plenty of other worlds on our list. Copy that, Vanguard. Plotting the landing path. Okay. Mm -hmm. So. Sort of recognize the voice of the captain. Uh, this planet introduces the lander, landings, and limited supplies to the campaign. So on the lander board, place a marker in the starting space, <coughs> indicated with the S. Uh, the landing track represents your progress towards the planet's surface. Oh, so basically, okay. the more agile a lander is, uh, that depends where this starts. So if, the, if, the, if it was not very agile, it would start here, and it would be a longer process before you land on the planet. So okay. it starts there. So we haven't seen landings before. Also, we're going to be coming across certain rules in this video, which we've not done before. Mm -hmm. So there is going to be some referring to the rule book for how those things work. <laughs> Roll the danger die. Oh, gosh. Mm. If more see. than one option is available, choose one. You cannot choose an option. You cannot fully resolve. In rare cases where a crew member would gain a fourth injury, ignore that injury card and injury die. So what? What? Uh, I think we just. Letter? I think we just click proceed. There you go. So roll. Roll oh. the danger die. Oh gosh. Well, one spiky bit or four. Well, no, captain. four spiky bits is good. That means we have a clear landing path. One spiky bit means oh, we were debris, warned about the debris, weren't we? We were warned about the debris. That card is. Yeah. No, I've got armor. Yeah. One spiky bit. <laughs> Typical. Debris impact. Okay. Do so, we? yeah, I'm going to turn the sound down. I need to speak to them about that because that, that is. Yeah, but it's just annoying. <laughs> we are idea. en route to the designated landing zone. We have, we can either choose, so we've hit some debris. Yeah. We can either expose the cargo bay. We lose four supplies reduced by armor. But our armor is four because we've got two. Plus two. Oh, we got yeah. it up. Yeah. So lose that. Or we brace for impact and each crew member gains a wounded injury. So, so I, I think we choose the first one. Top one. So expose the cargo bay. Lose four supplies reduced by armor. Done. Sweet. Yeah. Progress the landing track. Move the marker one space to the right. Someone else is going to roll next time. <laughs> Has the marker reached the landing space? No. No. Roll the danger die. All right then. Here we go. This is, what, this is what the recon team think. <laughs> one, spiky oh, one spiky bit. Well, I, I'm, I'm going to guess this is the same. It's the same. Yeah. So because we've got four armor, we're all right. Yeah, we're all right. If we didn't have it's four armor, armor we'd, have lost four we'd have lost. Supplies. We'd have lost loads of supplies. Yeah. We'd have. There you go. Done. Done. Are we there? No. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Next. <laughs> 
Go on. I'm gonna... Yeah, go for it. I don't think it matters because we've got the four armor. We've got the armor. Well, unless we unless something else. Well, well, oh, oh yeah, there's other. We don't know what other does. <laughs> Hey. Oh, we, Hooray, we know what that one does like. Bash, bash, bash. bash. <laughs> well, I expose the cargo bay. The debris is hit it, the ship three work? times. We had shields. Heavy armor plating. Yeah, bash, bash, bash. I'm just stuck on some parts of the crust are thick enough have to land a spaceship on. Yes, yeah, right. You have right arrived here. safely at your destination. Phew. This Sorry. planet introduces leads and discoveries to the campaign. If you trigger an effect that asks you to draw a lead before the leads mechanic is introduced, Read the leads and discoveries rules in chapter three of the rulebook. This planet also introduces threatening injuries. Uh -oh. Keep in mind that gaining a fourth injury will trigger a forced evac. Whenever in doubt about the injury rules, read the injuries and ending planetary exploration rules in chapter three of the rulebook. Now, open the Planetopedia at pages four to five. Let's get this out of the way. Get all that out of the way. Yeah. Next page. Okay. Yeah. No. Yeah. Are we for the positioning on the table? Yeah, that's good. Um, yeah, then open the there. ship book at page twenty-four and perform the begin planetary exploration procedure. Here we are. Let's just put that there. This is smaller than the last one, I think. Mm. Looks well. So as far as we know. Okay. Things aren't replaced. So let's move the app out of the way for now. And we have beginning planetary procedure. So just to show people, we're now following this bit. And then at the end of this bit, we basically play the game. So prepare the planet board. We're starting at step 1B. Populate the right side of the planet board with the indicated unique discoveries, placing them face down in the order in which they are listed. So we need unique discovery 2 and 3, with 2 on top and 3 below. Mineral leak. We needed them. Two and three. Two and three. Two right. Top. Uh, next, populate the right side of the planet board <laughs> with the listed mission cards and global condition cards, or follow any planet specific M21. instructions printed mission. in mission and global card slots. So we need M21. This is on here. That already. is already on there. And so if the time goes away, then we replace it. Oh, so we have a time track already. A time track. Yeah. We have a time track yeah. already. Yeah. Okay. I'm just going to show people. What M21 is there you go so that's our global condition card Do you want me to read the got. mission I was just going to have a look at the global condition but yeah go on read the mission mission among the ashes this broken world offers few surviving landmarks but a large cluster of potentially interesting structures stands not far from the landing zone we must comb this area inch by inch the objective is to fully explore the sector with uh, this symbol on it that one. So we need to fully explore fully sector explore five. Mm -hmm. Okay, right. And the global condition card is <clears throat> crystalline shards. Sharp shards of pale red crystal carpet the rock beneath our feet. We can we can dig. If we get a dig thing, we can get a mineral lead. So that I believe when can we do that? Is a dice combination. Right. Like on the bottom of a card. Yeah. I think that's what that is. Has it got a similar kind of symbol? Yeah, sort of. Sort of. Um, to travel, I think, is either just, uh, spend a dice or roll the danger dice to move to a connected sector. So same as it was on the previous one? Yes, that's the same. Uh, but it's the A one, which is up here, which would be one spiky is right. spend so, a dice, two is game. So we're looking for dice combinations on global condition cards. Where's that one? That little A is on the Oh, yes, you can dice. see it there. Okay, right. yeah. Is that Great, one? yeah. If you have icons in the roll pool that match the dice combination requirement on the clo on the current global condition card, you may move the required dice to their owner's spent pool to apply the effect. This may be done multiple times <coughs> using different dice for each time you apply the effect. So in step five of a dice check, mm -hmm. that counts. So you're getting that. So every time counts. you have a spare gather icon, you can gain a mineral lead. Or once you fill a vanguard. Or a vanguard. And once you've filled up, you replace that card with GO2. Yeah, yeah and tracker. we have a time track on there as well. So what is a mineral lead? Well, that's a time we'll we'll, we'll go to the leads when it happens. No, it's out of the bag. Paul's got the bag of leads. Oh, I've got a bag of leads. Okay, nice. 
I've got a box of leads at home. <laughs> right. All, yeah, all yeah, H- HDMI <laughs> leads. <laughs> you know, place, place the lead bag next to the planet board. Ensure that it contains 20 lead tokens. Do you want to just take them out? I've counted yeah. them, but just show everybody what they look like. Oh. Okay, so those are lead tokens, and there are 20 of them with all sorts of different icons on. Yeah, stuff and bits. And, and uh, we'll get to that when it happens. Things. Right. Discovery decks. Peter, would you like to get out all five discovery decks? Okay, right. Here we go. So we have five different types of discoveries. Mm. Alien tech discoveries. Mm. And each one of these will be shuffled and then placed. The strange <coughs> Flora. Oh, who is Strange Flora? Can we get to meet her? <laughs> Later. So technically, they're supposed to go here in these Spread five spots, the but just because of the layout, I think if we just put them, just put them across there like that. Yes, yeah, so we don't have a space for the other things. No, exactly. So we've got no rank up. Well, where, where's the rank up go? Well, maybe, maybe we don't rank space. For extra maybe, maybe we can't rank up in this. Mission. No, we can. I don't. I don't know where it is. But yeah, there should be a. I mean, as long as they're as long as we're they're going to put along there. Yeah. What was the other? And that's fine. Oh, will will they fit there? Yeah. Okay. Right. What was the other thing we had at the top there as well on the other one? Just a rank up cards something. and success tokens success and tokens. discoveries. Success tokens. So I don't quite space. know where they go, except maybe they go here. Because we have the land. Oh there. yeah, rank up card. Oh, the rank up card goes there. Uh-huh. Ah, discoveries. Uh, rank up card goes there. Other, to- go there. other tokens oh, and markers, so successes are going to right. go. Right, right, got it. <coughs> okay, pile nice. them up. Nice. Um, shuffle the event deck, which is also you, Peter. Oh, sorry. So there's a big event deck. <laughs> <laughs> playing with the lander <laughs> <laughs> and place it to the left of the planet. Here. So we'll just we'll just put the events here, right, maybe. Events. I think. Um, yeah, that was in. Well, I've taken the injuries out because it's. We will need the injuries in a minute. Place yeah. the injuries deck to the right of the planet board. So we use the whole deck this time for the events. But there's lots of different types of injury, which is interesting. I don't know if they get shuffled when you get they them random. They don't. No, they don't. So we want to take the injuries and just pop them maybe over there. Yeah. If we put, if we've got wounded being separate because we gain a wounded injury from the danger dice specifically. Possibly. No, yeah. I've just started shuffling these events. Yeah, they shuffle the event. It. Shuffle the event deck and place it. Okay. It says to the left of the planet board, but we can put it there. Yeah. Or we can put it above, whichever. Okay. Are these in their own piles? Yeah, but there's too many of them, so I think just have them in one big pile. Okay. Right, disembark. Unless your lander has already been placed on the planet board, it which it hasn't, place it in any sector that depicts the lander icon. Now, we only have one sector that depicts the lander icon, so that's where the lander goes. <laughs> yeah, don't break it. That would be, that would be silly. <laughs> <laughs> um, so they make suitable noises. Yeah. This is now referred to as the lander <laughs> sector. <laughs> Ding, ding, microwave. <laughs> there was the seatbelt <laughs> side going on. <laughs> All right. You may now disembark. Here, here. If the crew member minis of the away team have not yet been placed on the planet board, place them in the lander sector. What is this? A spaceship for ants? Take the rank up cards from card tray A. So we need the rank up cards. Shuffle them and draw two at random. And then as a group, we choose which one we want and place it. Incomplete side up in the indicated space next to the planet into the landing board. If the place Sorry. cannot agree, the science section makes the final. Oh. Me. <laughs> I don't agree. It's not going to be that. So, choose, choose two and then two, two, two at random. random. Right. Let's have a look. You want to stick them, stick them on here so we can have a look? <clears throat> uh, that's completed. <laughs> Gosh, okay. Uh, Any time during planetary exploration, we can do a dice check to study volatile fumes, but only in a sector with... Uh, have we got any of them? They're biome icons. Yeah, any of those biome icons? We've got any of them? Mm-hmm. Can't oh, see They're going to be on them. cards, aren't they? No, it's, well, possibly, but... We don't know what's going to At the end around. of the planetary rotation, flip this card if you have three microorganism discoveries on your lander board. Well, hmm. maybe we're not getting any of them. So it's a, probably a bit of a guess, really, as to which one we go for. I'm guessing that those symbols will be on cards. Might appear on well, they might not, well, they might not. They might not be. They might be on different planets. Yeah, true. 
True. Hmm. In fact, both of those might. But don't we need micro? To... Don't don't we need some microorganisms for? Actually... Yeah, but this seems to give us mineral leads. For, for our discoveries, the, one not the, leads. One of the one of the uh, one of our. Okay, so this is. Yeah, I think there's two things on here. Are these the this is biomes. This is the biomes that are on. The, I think there's two oh, things. Yeah. This is a special action. So whenever you are in a sector with either that 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 or that, you can study the volatile fumes. But that's separate from that. I think I think flipping this card by doing that is separate from this. I think if we get three success tokens, yeah, we rank. If we if we're rank one, we, we, we need three success oh, tokens. If we were rank, we rank two, two, we, we would need six. six. <clears throat> so I think these two things we can do e are separate. Either. Let me just check this in the rules, or if anybody's watching, who knows? Thirteen, twenty-five, forty-four. But then 44. flip the card. We've completed the rank, and then you get the rank. We get that. Look. So a card that lists the required. Because that's on both sides. Oh, that's just a remind. So you've got to do it and get the success tokens to rank yeah. up. That's what oh, it looks okay. like. Right, okay. I mean, microorganism discoveries, those green cards. We might get them. We yeah. might. That yeah. and that and that. Flip this card. Yeah, but only that, in that, sectors that with those biomes. those biomes. And if those biomes are not on the board at the moment... They're not there now. We'd I, have I to, don't think no, they're going to be there. Because that's kind of like the terrain. Does that mean we can't rank up if we've... Very possibly. Yeah. Unless we find three microorganism discoveries. So we're going with that one? I would. Okay, so that goes there. Take a chance. Well, the science officer says yes. Oh, right, says that's okay. <laughs> Thank you, science officer. Yeah, Skycroft says a yes. shattered planet has the likelihood of having microorganisms. But we will find out. We, we will, will find yeah, out. We'll find right. out. What's next? But there's strange structures. So uh, there if there are no more rank up cards in card tray A, so when we run out of rank up cards, you go to the removed from game, shuffle them and start again. Right. Okay. Yeah. D. Players divide personal equipment cards and mission equipment cards between them. No crew member may carry carry equipment cards of another section. Okay. If players cannot agree, the recon section player makes the decision. <laughs> I'm gonna have my day one day. <laughs> <laughs> How many personal equipment can you carry? carry? What does it say? I don't know. Well, you've got to say. carry that. I'm going to have that. Yeah. You've got to carry the jetpack. I have to carry this one. I'm guessing if we get a medikit each. There we go. Yeah. So we're going to take one each, but I don't know if there is a limit on how much. So is it just go cards? No particular place, really. Equipment for no jetpack. Jetpack. Move to another connected sector, ignoring the path icons. This counts as an action. I can just jump to any so, sector. Each crew member may carry any number of equipment cards. There you go. There you ah. go. Um, but small equipment does not take any space in the lander. So anybody can carry any number of equipment, but during when we decided to come here, we could have taken one small equipment each. Small equipment is the stuff that we don't like. We, yeah, which, which we, we don't have. We've got personal have, equipment. We've got personal have. equipment. Yeah. I'm just going to slip my jetpack on. Crew members in the same sector may freely exchange equipment cards that don't have a section icon. Okay. So, so you could give that med kit to anybody else if you need to. Right. Yep. Um, right. Each crew member places a turn token on their crew board. Turn turn side up. I think yeah. I'll put it there. Each crew member draws a number of section card indicated on their crew board from their section deck. That's based on your rank, that should say. So two so cards. Two, because we're rank one. The recon section player chooses a crew member to receive the start token. Now, before we go any further, we should probably look at two cards where we are. Where we are, the routes between places. Orbiting shard. And Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we are we're all here. We cannot travel from here. So no. there's the first thing. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna have to scout the site first. We need that, that, and that. We don't want that. Go to log two one zero, which presumably replaces this card with another card. Yeah. So we've landed on an orbiting shard, and then we need to do this, and presumably that will then open up the route to there and there. What's up there? Can you read upside down? Failed shelters. This desperate attempt to survive the apocalypse was doomed from the start. No bunker or shelter could have survived this. So we're gonna open the shelters, gain two alien tech leads. Okay. The yellow success with computer. Yeah. Uh, or a blue and a red. Gain one success, what are they called? Success tokens. Success yeah. tokens and unique discovery three. Right, so that's how we get unique discovery three. Replaced with card P112. This is how we get unique discovery two. Yeah, so we want to get both of them because yeah. this is our one shot to get them, yeah. really. Yeah. 
And that's our reason for being. And then here. that one goes to here. Spending two and dice. Spending two dice. That one goes to there. The movement icon. That's double two. Like that's that, that one and that one. That one. That okay, one, yeah. but that's the one you're saying we need to. That's the one we need to fully explore. Fully explore for the mission. Okay. Right, so we can just get those and then come back to the lander, but we don't want to do that. We want to keep pressing on to complete the mission. Yeah. Complete the mission because we can't. We can't. We can leave if we want. We can leave. We, we can, but if we leave, not having achieved the mission, I think there's like a missing mission failed token and bad stuff happens. Mm -hmm. Don't want that. something like. That. Morale, don't forget, we've also got this emergency. Think of the shame when we get back to yeah. the hangar. Morale. The emergency <laughs> broadcast system. If we need it, we can all lose a charge to get two supplies. Yeah. Which many is probably times worthwhile. No, you oh, no, it removes that card. Mm. Right. So we need to make sure we've got a charge left. I only started two. I've got two. Yeah, all of us have to lose a charge. Well, yeah. One each. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm, I'm, I've got uh, fisticuffs. Well, fisticuffs. And, fisticuffs. I've, and I've got compass. So you're going to be good at scouting the site. My compass is my automatic six. I can, I can turn a That's it for the snowflake into... Uh, right. I can turn a snowflake into... Mm -hmm. uh, so I could... I've got a... Four and six. Chance. And we need wow, one, two, that. three, four, five successes. Yeah. Wow. Well, um... They were buried in dust and half melted. The artificial structures are clearly visible on the orbiting shard. Okay. Well, I'm happy so somebody's been here and blown this planet yeah. up. There used to be a, uh, people living on this planet once upon a time. Mm. I'm happy to give it a shot. So you're going to go first? I'll go first if you like. Yep. <clears throat> You take that. So have a look at our cards. Don't forget that. that. We might have yeah, cards that could help. Look at the cards. Yeah, good idea. Yeah, that's quite nice actually. So one danger of right, okay. lead tokens. We haven't got any of them yet, have we? We haven't got any lead tokens. I'll read the rules on okay. lead tokens when it tells us to take a lead token. About lead tokens. Okay. Uh, so I'm definitely taking so this. So first action. So the first action is going to be a special action. You're going to do this? Yeah. I'm yeah, going to scout the site. Help. So how many dice do you want to use? So I'm all going to use... Them. And we can all assist. We yeah. All assist. Although I can't really. Cause That's I true. I think I can do the help. Um, but the more that I use, the more, more chance I've got of taking the... Yep. Uh, so I'm definitely going to take those, that one and that one. But potentially we could do this. One, which has got... Only one or the risky, dice. But we've got a chance. <laughs> Chance of filling up two of the slots straight what away. Does, what does the uh, what does the the, the the accident accident progresses the red progresses right? red yeah. and it needs a big, and it's four before you lose two dice. Yeah, five. Things are really right. Have you so got, got a reroll of green? Or I've got like a reroll. Yeah, I've got a reroll green. Just zoom yeah. in. So I, and I've got a reroll red. So um, this is where we are. Might might go for this actually. That's what we're doing uh, right now. I mean, Paul can help. He's got the red fisty cuffs yeah. as well. Okay. So Not to save that. Well, you can do that if you if you assist and then roll your mining thing and get it. You could do that instead. As uh, instead. Which turn is it? Sure when is that? Which, which part of the phase is that? You can do that when chip? you're step five. Dice combinations. Step five. Dice combinations. So we could, yeah. So we could actually. But you can save that for later. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, I'll tell you what. So, Let, so I'm going to assist. You are going to assist. And I'm going to assist by putting lots. this okay. into my roll pool. In that case, I'll save one dice okay. for me. Don't forget you can do that. Spend one charge to choose a crew member assisting, assisting you. Oh, the other way around. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to assist, I think. You're going to assist as well. In that case, yeah, I'm, I'm going to use three. Time. Okay. Blue dice because... Right, okay. Yeah. So okay. we all now roll our roll pools. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh Ouch. dear! Right, I can re-roll. Yeah, Let's I start can. again. <laughs> well, so that was step three. Step four: modify the results. We can both play a card. Yeah, I'm good. And I can play a card. Yeah. I think you can play as many cards as you want. Okay, fine. I re-roll one, which is that one. Okay, so I can assist as well by getting. Re I can re-roll a blue if need be. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, good. Two, Look at that. three, four. That's four right there. Sorry. Oh dear. Oh. So well, hang hang on a minute. Before we all just do that, you didn't need to do anything. Well, I've got four. We need five, yeah, don't we? Because Paul's got four six. Oh, we need five, did we? Yeah, it's four oh, things, look, right, and then okay. one to get there. So I can reroll that. I mean, it's not as well. a problem because yeah. two 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 of these We've is just got... two along there. We just haven't done it all in one go. It's yeah. just action economy, isn't it? Yeah, it is. <laughs> it is, and also if we've got extras left over, we can use them to get mineral deeds. If, if you've got, got the mining symbol, well, or a vanguard. I could get you to re-roll the blue. 
That's my assist. Can you assist me? Good question. I'm assisting the roll pool. That that dice is in the collective oh, roll pool. So if yeah. you if you play, you that, are playing the card roll. as if you played it. Go on then. Mm -hmm. So you can roll one die in the roll pool, which is oh okay, yeah, that right. one. yeah, okay, yeah, got it. Oh, wow. Are there any other sides on that? No. Yeah, that is the wild dice. Yeah. It's 50 50. Yeah. <laughs> we're on it three times. Yeah. Okay. Right. Well, um... okay. So, so, what do we want to do? Do do? I mean, I could re roll this. I'm tempted to re roll it again, actually. <laughs> it's just using lots of cards. It, it, I can, it is. I, I've got during a dice check re roll red. Does that Nick re -roll allow you red? to re-roll yours? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, it allows you to re-roll that. It allows me to re-roll. That's well, in the roll well, I'll, I'll do that then. Well, you can roll it, Paul. Yeah, Paul, Paul can roll it. <laughs> so you're playing Just, the card. I'm playing the card. It's my last card. Uh, you can turn that into a compass, which no. is one of the things we need. I can, turn, oh, you can. I can treat that as if... You can't. Oh, no, no, no. Because you're assisting. Yeah. But it stops a, a, a bad yeah, it's thing not, on the It's track. not a bad thing. I'm, okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use this card. <laughs> Doing it. You're doing all of it here. Wow. We've thrown everything in. Yes. Yes. Um, there's a comment in the chat about the playmats. The playmats are really nice. Unfortunately, they didn't quite fit on this table. The playmat is about yep. that big. Right. And the four player with the playmats, they didn't quite fit on the table. So, yeah. So, is that five successes? Yes. Well, we. so step four is done. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, step four is done. Step Modified. five dice combinations. Yeah. So, do you have any other cards? Uh, I don't have anything in my hand anymore. Right. Okay. Step six, injury and danger dice. Nope. None. Step seven, resolve special effects. So, we have special effects. So, we've got... We've got no warnings. Do we have that? Yeah. We've got one of those. We've got those. three of those. And we've got one of those. Oh, five of them. So, we've got, yeah. we got five. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five. So, we put a marker on. One, two, three, oh, so top four, to five. Yeah. And those dice are spent. So all of the dice used for that purposes are spent. Then we go down to the next special effect. There are no accidents, so that doesn't progress. Uh, we skip step eight because it's got tracks on it. Uh, step nine, spend a dice. So that goes to there. And then step ten is resolve the outcome. You could have done... No, no, you got, it's not your turn. You couldn't have used that with a... You can't do dice combinations when it's not your turn, I believe. Okay. Yeah, I don't think you can help with dice combinations when you're assisting. Okay. So we are reading log 210. Vanguard, this is away team one. My sensors are picking up some electromagnetic activity among the rubble. I'll try to reach it. Be careful, away team. This planet looks too much like a battleground. You should expect danger and... Okay, got it. It's just a small shard of some metallic magnetized casing. Nothing too exciting. We'll tune your sensors to the magnetic signature of this shard. This should help you find other similar parts. Roger that, Vanguard. Right. We have a, a potential rules mistake. I don't know. Are you only allowed to use one card? Because I played two. Yeah, well, I did say one card. I played that. I played two. It's your turn though. Yeah, isn't it? Peter couldn't have used two cards. So Thank you, Chuck. Okay. So it, it was we, just one. Do card. we want to roll that back? We've done the log now. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I haven't assisted yet. In which case, you did the re-roll. So I, I'll I'll do the re-roll, okay. which is re-roll a blue, which you did, and then so we you've got, got one in hand still. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you're absolutely right. When you're assisting, it's one dice and one card. Not all one card. Yeah, it's both. both. Okay. okay. Right. Um, okay. Gain one alien tech lead. Right. So we need to read the rules on leads. Mm. A lead. Leads. Lead tokens represent clues that guide crew members towards discoveries. At the beginning of planetary exploration, all 20 lead tokens are placed in the lead bag. Whenever instructed to gain one or more lead tokens, randomly draw them out of the bag and place them one by one in an order of your choice on top of the corresponding discovery deck. We're drawing one, and it's an alien tech lead. So you draw one out of the bag, and we put it on top of the alien tech discovery. Okay. No. Nice. Um, <laughs> if there are no leads available in the bag, you cannot gain any more leads. Lead tokens have a value between zero and three. 
Zero. <laughs> Zero. Oh, wow. um, when the total value of lead tokens on a deck is three or more, put all of the lead tokens on that deck by the side of the bag and then gain the top discovery card. If it has a reshuffle icon on it, place it back in the lead bag instead of placing it next to the bag. Uh, and sometimes they've got instructions on that says plus one card. When this lead token is placed on a discovery deck, a crew member chosen by the science section draws one section card. So one player I've got of one. your choice I've draws got one card. He's got none, but he did spend all his. I mean, mm. Well, spent them, <laughs> get, spent them to do this. It's up to you. <laughs> So and then you. draw another card. Are you sure, science officer? Yes, can they? Thank you, science officer. I'll um, turn the favour. Well, 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 only because I've got this thing where I'll move one lead token from a deck to another deck. So if I if that if that was a three, you could have moved. I could it. have moved it to microorganism, which would have helped yeah. potentially get us oh, getting our yes. rank up. Right. Okay. So he says here leads are small clues, such as pieces of alien technology, biological samples, or even the paw prints of an alien creature. If you gather enough of them, you will be <laughs> rewarded with important discoveries from discovery decks that you will take with you to ISS Vanguard. So gain one alien tech lead means that you should draw one lead at random from the bag and place it on the alien tech discovery. Uh, yeah, we've done that. Each lander has a different maximum number dis of discoveries that it can hold. <coughs> okay. Right. So five. Yeah. Uh, when you finish your planetary exploration, you must discard your discoveries down to the number visible on the lander board. Some leads also have special rules. And note the global conditions of this planet allows you to gather more leads. So does, does it? The number it? Oh, that the manual lead yeah. which goes onto here. So is that number there the number of cards we're going to get? No. no. No, we just need this. That's a counter. Three. That's how far three. we are through. <coughs> Replace the card numbers. in your sector with P110. Which is Peter. Peter110. Yeah, Peter110. That's points of interest, is it? Points of interest. P110. Yeah. Here we go. P110. This one goes over here. So it's Melted cool? Cityscape. A civilization once bloomed here, but ended abruptly by a fiery inferno. Many of the remains are covered in thick layers of ash and volcanic rock. Wow. So we now can travel from here. Okay. So and we have a new special action to find artifacts. Yeah. Okay, well I've done my special action. You have so done your one I special will, action. Uh, now move. Suddenly, a thing that I had that allowed me to do extra things on a... a Flagged locations, you know, the AI thing. Come in away, team. We have something you really should see. Yes, Vanguard, we read you. Our AI analyzed the data you gathered while scouting these ruins. It does seem there was an advanced civilization living on the planet. However, your current area was subject to extreme temperatures, irrecoverably damaging most artifacts. Tell us something we don't know, Vanguard. The rocks here melted like butter. The point is, not far from your position, there's a cluster of underground structures, maybe shelters of some kind. If you want to find anything more than charred pieces of tech, the AI suggests you go there, but... There's always a but, isn't there? Well, our military advisors disagree with the AI. They warned us the crystal had something to do with the death of this planet, and they say we should investigate one of the crystalline arms before we attempt anything else. Understood. Leave it with us, Vanguard. Mm -hmm. Find mission card M23. There's Place another. it face up on an empty outline on the right side of the planet board. There's another oh, right space. there. Okay. Uh, you now have two missions, one marked as optional. You needn't complete any optional missions for your landing to succeed, but they can often be profitable or allow you to see events and locations you wouldn't see otherwise. Optional mission, learning more. Vanguard's AI thinks the ruined shelters are our best chance of learning more about the denizens of this world. However, military advisors believe we must focus on the crystal instead. So there's two different options. So ob objective, learn more about the crystal in sector two and slash or learn more about the people of this world in sector three. Mm. Completion. When you have, un have unique discovery cards two and three, discard this mission and gain a success token. Okay. okay. Success tokens from the last mission. It didn't tell us to put them here, so I think they stay in the they bag. They stay in the bag. I think so. Okay. Right. Whose go is it? Still got one action. It's your go. Action. And that was the first <laughs> that action. That's the first action. Right. So I've used my special action. So you can't do another special action. So I can't. Move. So I can either I can rest or prepare. Rest, um, prepare, travel, um, lift off. You could lift off. Yeah, I don't want to do that. For I you. disagree. Uh, yeah, I'm going to <laughs> disagree. I'm going to. I'm going to rest. That's a supply track already gone down. Oh no, that's the supply. That's the supply. Someone take a supply crate. Yeah, no. 
Okay. Um, can we just go through the prepare? Yeah, so the prepare the action we didn't really do this afternoon yeah. much. First of all, you draw a section card and or make a dice check. And the, the whole point of you making a dice check is to trigger any dice combinations of cards in hand. Which just refreshes our So you dice. could just prepare to draw a card. I'm just going to draw that. I'm if you wanted that. to. I'm going to prepare. Draw yep. a card. So you yep. draw a card. Yep, fine. But yeah, if you had a dice combination effect on there that was cool, yep. you might now want to do it. Because we were saying a lot of these dice combination effects require a lot less than the ones from the tutorial. Yeah, single dice. Single dice or single icons or, or whatever. Uh, so I could... Why not travel? So yep, why not travel? Because Paul's lazy and, he's, and he doesn't like going anywhere. Well, he stayed with us. Am I being criticised no. for, for sitting around? Maybe. <laughs> That's what he's done. That's what he's done. It's his, it's, I've done it now. Right. Yeah, he's the, he is the I've recon it, after all. Well, because he's going to get an event and he's he might, get an event. it's going to be bad and right. stay with us. Okay. So yeah. you're going to flip your turn thing over so and you I've, get... I've now, these are new, I've not seen any of these cards. No. Who knows what's going to happen? <laughs> we all die. You have to, but before we carry on, I just you know me, I like to use the right terminology. <laughs> These two biomes are Void, a special icon used when exploring space-based zero-g locations, mm -hmm. or when crew members are in near-void conditions with little or no gravity. And that one is Ruins, mm. planets covered in ruins, stroke structures mm. of alien civilizations, or with ancient mechanisms. Oh. So that's our current biome. Void and Ruins. Right, off right. you go. Okay, the event. Uh, so we're looking for biomes with a rock... A wheel and water. Do any so that's match? void. Is, yes, is, void. that's void. That's is it? Void. The that's wheel. Void. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah, I okay. just told you what they were. <laughs> oh, <is it> all right. <laughs> Vertigo. Mm -hmm. Oh dear. I, I, so you read in the bottom bit. I read the bottom bit. Okay. So either I spend a green die, or I roll the danger die. No, the which danger die? The There's one? a tiny little letter in the middle of it. Oh, C. Okay. Oh, the C version. How bad is the uh, C danger die? One, two, or four is, is all bad. <laughs> yeah, I'll spend the die then. Okay. Yeah. But no time tracks advancing or anything like no that? No time tracks. Just spend a green die. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna, I might put these over here. Yeah, I've just realised actually to get this second part, you actually need two reds, don't you, and a blue? Two reds and a blue. Yeah. yeah. Okay, never mind. Well, that's the success of a, a pickaxe and a whatever that is. Uh, Xenology. Z okay. So a Vanguard symbol is what you tell me. <laughs> yeah, we don't have any Xenology experts. <laughs> no, no, it's probably the old no. woman with the plants. I've got, I've got, I've got <laughs> yeah. Right. Okay. Right then. Over to me. me. Who are you now? You're Andrew. I'm Andrew McVeigh. Andrew McVeigh. Sounds so normal compared right. to everybody else. Yeah. I'm Ida Rao, and I'm now drinking coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Tired. <laughs> So I can move one lead token from a thing to a thing, but uh, moving a zero seems pointless. So, uh, well, I'm going to try doing this, I guess. I can r roll two blues and a red. I'm not going to be able to roll a pickaxe, because I don't have any. Right. So two blues and a red is not going to do that. Two blues Sorry. and a blue. I guess you're right. But I could join in. You could join in. Well, you've got loads of reds. And I can join in. But you only need... Because I'm Well, the thing red. is, we want a pickaxe. Mr. Pickaxe. Mr. Pickaxe over there. Oh, sorry, Mrs. Pickaxe. Mrs. But you Pickaxe. also need the xenology. Well, no, because if you get... if you, Oh, yeah, that's it's a plus, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, if okay, we yeah. get a Vanguard. Well, we need a Vanguard and a Pickaxe. Or two Vanguards. So you haven't used your dangerous Vanguard dice, but that hasn't got any accidents. Yeah, yeah exactly. So if I if I use this, yeah, then it doesn't matter if it's an accident because it's a red die. In fact, I might as well not bother using my other... I you might roll the Vanguard... But I could save. I could rod one blue. You could one more red and one red. I and mean, then worst case, we get the normal result. Yeah. But best case, we get the good result. Yeah. In fact, the best result, the bonus, is three alien. Yeah, it's good. It is good, but we haven't got that xenobiology, whatever the weather, have we? Unless okay. I roll my thing as well, just for hope to get a, a vanguard. Fifty percent chance. Yeah, go for it. So you're going to roll those two. I'm going to roll this one. You're going to roll that. One. Okay. Step three. Roll dice. Oh. Look. That's it. it. Oh, look at this. Well, that's it. All I need is those two. Oh, in fact, yeah, that's got double Vanguard on it. So that so would have been it. Have you got a card that you can use your... 
am I allowed to no, use? No, we we can't use dice combinations. Oh, okay. I think okay. dice okay. combinations you are you only use for you. One of, you could use one of those dice to do something else. Yeah. The annoying thing is it's refresh of two blue dice. Uh, well, uh, there, there's a Vanguard. There's a, there's a yeah, but I've got any. Oh, uh, yes, we could use that. I can use that to gain a mineral lead. Mm. Yes. yes. That's yes. totally the way to do it. Oh, well, that went well. Very good. <laughs> Yeah, so dice combinations are you can activate any dice combination effects of cards in your hand. Yep, okay. Or, oh, sorry, and or any dice combination effects of the current global condition which, card. Yeah, which I'm going to do. So it's only for the active player. Yep. So we use my pickaxe here. Uh, dice uh, that have been added it to the roll pool no. by assisting crew members may be used, but assisting crew members cannot use dice combination yeah. effects of their own cards. Right, okay. Right. So, so what are we going to do? I'm using these two to do this top one. Well, we're in step five first, dice combinations. Okay, so I'm going to use that pickaxe on this. So that, that gets spent, and we draw a mineral lead. So we draw a lead token and put it on top of the mineral deck. Right. I drew a zero last time, so you can't do worse. A it's one, a one. With a and then when when we get to three, that goes back in the bag, rather than being rather put being by the side of the bag. Uh, okay. Right. Okay. Okay. Then... So that's step five done. Yeah. Dice combinations. Step six. Injury danger. Right. Dynamic. Step seven. There's no special effects. Step eight. Mark the outcome. So okay. now you spend that to mark the top one. That outcome. That went well. Step nine. Spend yeah, remaining nice. dice. Um, not going to. Yeah. Do we not get that as well? Yeah, we're going to. We get will. Both. We only mark one outcome. Oh, okay. And now step ten. Resolve the outcomes. So we get two alien tech leads plus another alien tech lead. So three. So we're going to get three alien, alien, tech. alien tech leads. Giz, giz, giz. Off you go, sir. And that stays there. Does the mission require two symbols? Uh, uh, the, yes, it's got the, a plus. The special thingy, yes. There you go. It required the gathering icon and the xenology icon. Right, so I've got oh, a zero, zero, and a one. Oh. With no bonuses. Oh. <laughs> But that's all of the terrible tokens gone. Of course it is. Straight away. <laughs> on the bright side. <laughs> <laughs> well, they go to those two go back in the bag. Yeah, that's what you're saying. Yeah. Like heroes. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's a bit like uh, Thebes. The more the game goes on, the more you dig, the more sand you find instead of actual treasures. <laughs> but then other people can do that special thing again and get three more alien tech leads. Yeah, yeah. But that means we're just staying we, we there. can stay there forever, just getting alien tech leads. We need right. to get over here, don't we? Action one. Action two, I'm moving. You're not going to sit around then. Nope, that's it, I'm out of here. Uh, the question is where am I going to go? Do I listen to the AI? I think the science guy would probably listen to the AI rather than the military. So I'm going up here. Yeah, I think there's a typo in this rule book because it says lead tokens have a value between zero and three. Well, it's clearly wrong. <laughs> zero and one. Zero and one. one. <laughs> No, that must mean we have some good tokens no, to go with that. Right, no. so moving here, I need to travel. So either spend a dice or roll the A, Ooh. one of these, which is spend a dice or get an injury. So I think I'm just going to spend a dice. Okay. You're all done? You're in the fight. Uh, you flip your thing and draw I an event card. I do. Right, there's lots of different icons. Yeah, well, yeah, the first one does match. Okay. Either lob a red and another dice, or roll the B thing, which gives the option of oh, loads of bad things. Losing supplies. So what is it? Read the read the flavour. Corrosive fumes. Okay. <laughs> yeah. In these failed shelters. Well, <laughs> you don't get that in the uh, coffee shop where I am. Lame. <laughs> I've been off two dice. Painful. Uh, I will bin off. No, I'll keep. I'll get rid of that one and that one because there's reasons behind that. So if I can get that one, do my card. I can refresh two blues. Oh, yes, yeah. nice. Okay, is it me? Yeah. So, are we staying here to find any more alien tech leads, or are we moving on? I think we should move on. Do you reckon you could do it in one roll? Me? Well, I've got two red and a blue, so I could get one alien tech get lead. And you've used your epic win yeah. dice already. It yeah, seems a bit... Lose. That's the epic lose dice from now on. <laughs> but also, we don't want to move away from here unless we're done with here. Because once we've moved away from here to either there or down here, we won't be going back here. Except to get back to the, the land. Except to get back to the land. So I'm tempted to stay, 
but also up here is I need the computer uh, also I'm tempted to go down here and just do that I had a computer person because that just needs a red and a green there's no special effects or a pickaxe and I get you need discovery and a too for refresh all your dice that's... yeah I don't think we're going to be able to do that well that's just a red and a green this is a red and a blue that's yeah so I can do I, I can do any of those yeah. Whereas that is a much easier bonus action. That just needs one computer mm -hmm. icon. Which is that needs a gathering of science and a computer icon. A vanguard symbol for yeah, me. It's a vanguard, isn't it? Is it? None of us have got that. Uh, I, I, I got the computer. person with the shield instead mm. of the computer because that's what the thing told me to have. So what do we think? Stay <laughs> stay here and spend some dice and get one more alien tech lead. We might get a two. I mean part of me is thinking let's leave those zeros out so that they don't go back in. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And just give up on the idea well, of getting alien, alien tech, tech leads. leads. Is it? Yeah, look, if we get that top okay. lead, so it's, it's, it's all leads. alien tech leads. Well, I mean, mineral leads. If you get the pickaxes. Yeah, I'm not good with pickaxes. Okay. Oh, no, I think I'm going to go down here. Unless there's any objections, I'm going to go down here. Leading me up. You, there. you might get injured on the you're, way. Well, you're, you're following the military's advice. Am I? Yeah, because okay. I followed the science AI's advice. Right, so, so I need to roll danger yeah. die A. Danger die A. So danger die. Thematically consistent. Four, Four spikes, spiky nothing. bits. Whoa. Huzzah. Right, that's my first action. Good. Second Spice action suit. is I am going to do this. I am going to pick up one red and one green and danger die. It's, an, it's another A. Yeah, it's another A. And danger Now, I could assist. Can you? From anywhere, but do you need by to? spending a charge. Well, no, you don't need to. If I do it, if it helps, because those charges are gone. But if I get that, I get to refresh two blue dice. <laughs> oh no, because I can't. No, get no, my no. Card. Yeah, yeah, you're right. So it's you're just right. me. I'm on my own. Nobody's here helping me. I've no. got no friends. Oh. Right. So modify the dice. So, uh, yeah. I don't. Go I don't need to modify any of the dice. You know, getting a wounded injury. Dice combinations. No, we're all good. We're fine. So now we resolve the danger die. Two spiky bits on A. Wounded injury. There you go. Uh, maybe I should have done that. Uh, right. So I'm wounded. And I get a injury die. And I'm just going to put it there. Yeah. Okay. That's not too bad. Um, so that was step... Six. Step seven, there is no special effects. Step eight, mark the outcomes. So I'm going to spend a red and a green dice. Uh huh. And I'm going to mark that outcome. Step nine, spend remaining dice. I don't have any. Step ten, gain a success token. Nice. Gain unique discovery two. It's a crystalline shard. So, yeah, we get a research project thingy. Um, and replace this with card P111. Okay, so it's only if you fail you go to log 54. Yeah, so it did say at some point in the rule book, let me just uh, scroll down and look at this, that failing might actually lead to future story choices. Because mm. yeah. if you fail, you read log 54. That yeah. might actually being end up being good. Neg being good. Oh, P111, odd. resupply depot. This crystalline arm extending far into space can be supplied directly from Vanguard if we're desperate enough in order to order an emergency drop. So emergency supply drop. You must discard one success token to perform this action. Gain three supplies. Replace with Ooh, card P000. Nice. Zero, zero, zero. Okay, so that's, that's there. So as a special action, you do that. You discard a success token. It's still a roll. It's still a roll. And an accident's bad, but if but any two dice together is getting three supplies, which is good. That is good. Which is good. Which we're all going to need shortly. <laughs> right. We're just about to run out of dice. That is the end of my turn. I'll draw an event card. Biomes. So what biomes have we got there? We've got the void and the crystal, and we've got shard, shard. crystalline, crystalline. Nope. None of those match. Nope. If no one comes match, discard this card and progress all time tracks by one. So we've got our time has started to tick. I'm done. 
It's good this. It's good this. <laughs> I think the first play of it, it will be your best play because it is discovering, it is exploring. You don't know. But if there's so much, I'm going to forget things by half. Oh, yeah, that's what's yeah, happened at yeah. the beginning. If there's 20 planets worth to go to. <laughs> There's no one I'm going to remember. Well, let's 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 go up here. So you travel. Hi. So it's the travel icon, which yep. is either in a dice or roll the A. Splendor die or danger die A. Oh, let's go for it. Uh, Blank. Nothing. Uh, is that anything? Nothing. Okay. Well done. Success. Dodge the. Dodge the. Dodge the bullet. The bullets mm -hmm. and the. Right, so let's have a red and a blue. So this is here. So you're going to open the shelters. Have I got a vanguard? Oh, I've got a single vanguard on that blue. I've got a single vanguard. Yeah, every dice has one, doesn't it? It's a dangerous check. Yeah, it is. So you need I'm to have a danger die as well. well. So if I, if I do that, I've got a two in six chance of getting a computer. But you've got a 100% chance of getting a red and a blue. 100% chance of getting a red and a blue. And what is it? It's A, isn't it? A yeah, danger ice A. It's very small, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, little A. Yeah, and do, it's big on the screen. Do need a pair of glasses to see <laughs> see the little danger icons. No, I could, if I put in another die, I could potentially. Uh, that's actually. Oh, I could re roll this one. Oh, that's interesting. If I. As before, after an action, or if I f if I fail, now if I if I fail, then I don't get to count them as being a red and a blue, do I? Well, yeah, there's no, fail. there's no fail. There is no fail. Well, if I, if I don't get a, a vanguard, mm -hmm. can I use one of these dice yeah. Yeah. to activate my um, matching? Uh, if you roll another blue, for example, and then you can do both. What does, it, what does it need? A in any dice? It says A. Yeah. yeah that's any one icon. So if you roll a, another blue. Yeah, so this is what I'm that saying. And that. If this is what I'm saying. If I if I was to roll these two uh -huh. and I don't get a vanguard uh -huh. symbol, can I have these as my red and my blue to succeed here? Yep. Yes. And no. use one of them. <laughs> no. Yeah, that's what I was asking. Roll another one yeah. and then you can. That's why I was saying, shall I roll another die? Depends on that does, I guess. Is it worthwhile? So I think I will. I'll roll another die. It gives me a chance of another Vanguard, so mm -hmm. it's now three mm -hmm. and six. Chance. Uh, 50 who's chance. there as well? Me. You're there, so you could assist if you wanted to. I oh. could, but I've only got the one die. So. Yeah. Okay, well, let's see what happens. What are we doing? We're, we're exploring. Opening, opening, the, opening now, the shelters. Have you done this action yet? Are we saying he's done, he hasn't... Because I've got before or after any action. Do you reckon but I can do he this has, now? He's, he has technically started to do the action. Because he's created his dice pool. Okay. Yeah. But if you didn't, if you wanted to do that... Only because what I'll do is I'll move the zero... Because we're getting alien tech. I'll move one of these re-put in zeros to strange flora. What about microorganisms? Well, we might want to get that. I'm thinking that we won't want to put the zero back in the bag. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you're going to move a lead from any discovery deck to another discovery deck. Okay, sure. Because right. we might get this this turn and it'll go back in the bag. Because yeah. we don't want to happen. So we're here, aren't we? Yeah. Okay, I've got a single spiky spike. It's an A, isn't it? So you have to discard a dice. Well, hang on. Let's go Spend through the, the thing. First of all, modify the results. Okay. Do you want to modify any of those results? Um, I can re-roll a blue one. But then if I do that, I don't get to Correct. use... Yeah. Ah, no. No. Okay. Step six, resolve the injury and danger die. Which is... Spend a dice. So you have to spend, you've only got one dice left to spend, so you spend that. Okay. Uh, step seven, special effects. We have no special effects on that particular check. So now mark the outcomes. Right. Um, oh no, sorry, dice combinations. Dice, dice combinations, combinations should have been before the danger die. Okay. Well, that, that green one. So you spend it. I'm going to spend. Yeah. And it allows me to roll this one. And out out of roll. your spent pool. Yes. All right. Okay. Roll, pro, roll a die from your spent pool and add it to your roll pool. Okay. Do you so want I'll to go for your that. more chances of a vanguard dice? Well, he's using the one with the pickaxes on. Why? For this? Yeah. You got fifty percent chance on the other one to get the computer. Depends what you want to go for. Yeah. Does it no, have to be a red? No, that's a good point. Good point. Uh, I'm gonna. Yeah. 
I'll just do that. Okay. Save it now. It's not going to work. <laughs> if this goes wrong, yeah, exactly. it's all down the science officer. If it goes See, wrong, not that there's any kind of tension between engineering and science. <laughs> <laughs> oh, See, oh. I, I knew logic. I should have rolled that one. It's the, it's the point okay. of years. It's what it's the point of years. <laughs> the logic. Okay. Okay. So we didn't do that, but we did do that. So we get a success token. So we mark that outcome yep. by spending a red and a blue dice. Red and a blue. Go there. And then spend any remaining dice. And now we... No, not that one, the bottom one. Yeah. And now we gain a success token. Oops. And unique, unique discovery, discovery three. three. Okay, unique discovery three. Scorched records. Mm -hmm. Planetary exploration. When you gain this card, each crew member draws a card. So this presumably goes here. Yeah, so during planetary exploration... Each crew member draws a card. Nice, nice. Thank you very much. Yeah. Remember, we have a hand limit of two at rank one. Yeah, one well, going from zero to one. Yeah. Uh, and so then we replace that Scott with card P112. 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 Where are you? P11. P112. Here we are. Yeah. Which is uh, resupply depot. This crystalline arm, which this is all sounding a bit familiar, it's exactly <laughs> the same as that one. Oh, okay. P one one one, and this one's P one one two. two. Yeah. Okay. It is exactly the same. Okay. Okay, more chance to get supplies. So we have again. another resupply depot there. Yeah. So that was my first action. Now, did you move? No, second action. And so that's that, both yeah. of my actions, yeah. which mean I turn my thingy over if I can find it. There it is, and draw an event card. This is where it all. It was horribly wrong. Uh, event. Devouring Torrent. Ooh. Do we have any icons that match? It is. Have, yeah, what was it? It's Void uh, and Ruins. No, 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 we don't. Okay, so instead. If no items match, discard this card, progress all time tracks by one. Dink. Okay. Yep. Right, end of the first round. There We're we not go. dead. Where Still is alive. We just spent all our dice. So we, <laughs> yeah, we yeah, flip we... these back. <laughs> Who's going to go first next round? What is it we're trying to do? Didn't we have a mission to yeah, fully explore this location? Yeah, but wasn't there another one? Get two uh, and three. Oh, got two and three, which we've got now. Go. Go. When you have unique discovery two and three, discard mission and gain a success. That's all that is. Oh, right. Okay. Right. Okay, look at that. Discard we're mission. Already, we've got enough for promotion. Yeah. I'm not sure where this goes. I'm guessing it goes... We put yeah. the others in the out of play. <laughs> well, we did, but it doesn't say remove it from the no. game. It just says discard it. So I'm not sure where that goes. Okay. For yeah. Do we get a pay rise when we get promoted? <laughs> <laughs> Don't know. Right. So who's going to go first in round two? Do we want to get three supplies? We can do because it goes up to twelve on our ship. Uh -huh. So we could do one of those things, but we need dice to be able to do it because <laughs> both of them are a dice check. I mean, I, I can I can do this unless I roll an accident, but I've got two cards. Well, what mm. I could do, I could rest and move. What I was, what I was, good, what I was thinking was, um, I I could spend my remaining dice to get here, so that we can read the log and find out what we need to do here, because we've got players that can then go here, find out what's going, on. find out what's going on. But because mm. just means all I'm doing is moving, but it just gives these two. Characters an option to uh, to do something for the supply crates. You, you say you're going to recon. Well, no, no, no. I'll be doing. I do do my thing. The recon section. Jetpack do. My jetpack allows actually. My jetpack allows me to go anywhere with a diet. Oh yes, yeah, thank you for that. I can go to any sector. Connected sector and building the uh, red. path icons. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be good between here and here. Look. Yeah. <clears throat> Spending one red instead of two dice. Yeah. So is there any benefit in us understanding what this log is all about? Go to this or one. that one? Who maybe? knows? You can move and then jetpack here. Who knows? Jetpack snugs, they call them. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think if I was going there, I might as well just go there. Well, yeah, you have two to spend. Dice and a thing. Whereas that's just one them and one dice. You'll oh, save a dice. Another connected sector. Sorry, I was, I was ignoring it. Yeah, you don't throw away a jetpack, do you? You keep no, it. No, no, you keep it, but I was, I was assuming that I was... Jumping too far. That's all right. 
Um, most of the equipment cards you're carrying may be used at any time during your turn, including in the middle of a dice check. Some equipment cards say this counts as an action. If it doesn't say that, it doesn't count as an action. This explicitly mentioned discarded cards go back to the card stacks. Right, okay, thank you. That was for their mission. Goes back right, to the card okay. stacks. Right. So it goes back here. Right. 23. So we're still deciding who's going to start. <laughs> we are, yeah, we are right, still deciding who's going to start. Well, I'm probably going to rest and then move to go here because I want not much to do. But therefore, we're going to want to do some supply runs, or we re I rest and do a supply run. But then we're also discarding our success tokens, which is yeah. a problem. On my turn, I'm thinking of preparing. Because I've got, I've got a dice combination effect that I want to use. I'm also so in got some dice. If you're in the same, well, yeah, if you're in the same space as us, we could medkit you. But well, I can. They have to be in the same space. Mm. When you're well, we no, split you're over there. Yeah. I'm, I'm here. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> the two healers are over here. I mean, does it matter who goes first? Not massively, I don't think. So we just stick as we are then. Okay. Yeah. Right. Okay, in that case, be all night. <laughs> yeah. Okay, fine. So I'm going to I'm going to spend the dice to yeah, move. In fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll mm -hmm. the injury dice. So where are you going to get to move? I'm going to move here. So you're going to do the travel icon, and you're going to choose to roll the what? Which letter is it? A. A. Okay. Three Nothing. spiky bits. No problem. Nothing. Okay. So the second action. So what is... we're saying is, you three have gone up there. Yeah. And 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 I've. Yeah, you, you, you're down there, but you're you are, you are secu you're you are deodorant or something. <laughs> you're you head of security or something. So you're you're meant yeah. to be protecting us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They've run away. I'm going to do this. I'm going to I'm going to try to get the supplies because you're going to we're all going to need them. Okay. All right. So, so special action, special dice action, check. dice check, two dice. Yeah. So you have to discard a thing to perform the action. You must you discard must a success. Discard token. A success. Okay. Well, we'll and do. if we fail, we we don't get it back. But it's it's worth it to get the supplies. Well, if you roll an accident, yeah. If can I you re-roll? You've got cards to replace the card. Cards to oh, I see with another card. Uh, yes. Well, I've got a, I've got a re-roll. Yeah, I've got a re-roll of the blue. And I've so, also got a re-roll of the blue. Okay. So I can re-roll. And you're not using crazy wild dice. No. And I'm not so using we should be crazy okay. Wild. <laughs> not not the uh, fifty percent lost dice. Off we go then. Right. So I can re-roll a blue. Yeah, well, I can or you can re-roll a blue. I can re-roll a blue. I can re-roll uh, a blue. Can use yours first. Use mine. Fine. Okay. Fine. No more rolling of dice. <clears throat> There's no injury. It wasn't dangerous. No, None don't. of that stuff. Don't need to modify it. Don't need any special effects. So we mark that outcome. You spend the dice. Yep. Easy, we gain easy. three supplies and that goes. Good. And I think we know what's on P000. Zero, zero, yeah. zero. And we've got Nothing nine supplies. And <laughs> I've got nine supplies. So that's going to go back Much into the better. thing. So that, it's, that's... It's, I'm going to use one soon. Yeah, I'm going to use one. Yeah, nine, because I thought one. six supplies is nowhere yeah. near enough. That's why those two are supply depots, aren't yeah. they? Yeah. And we've got a thing to emergency We've got our emergency well. broadcast system yeah. from yeah. our upgrade. Yep, yeah, that's... Uh, You're done? That's me done. Event card. Event card. Event horizon. Okay, uh, are we... Yeah, I'm on, I'm on brand. I'm wearing my Awaken <laughs> Realms hoodie. Uh, so we're in a completed... Fine, so it's just going to happen. No icons match. Discard this card. Progress all time tracks by one. Okay. Where are you? You're not here, are you? So yep, everybody's there. What? Yes, sorry. So I was looking, the, I'm looking at the wrong icon. I was looking at this icon, sorry. Yeah, it's this icon. Ruins. We match this one. What's ruins. this one? Ruins. 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 Okay, ruins. Impossible structure. Roll the danger die for C. Uh-huh. Okay. If this roll has no effect, refresh all blue. Oh. It has no effect. So you refresh, refresh all your blue. blue. Perfect oh, roll. For all of us, good. Just, you, just, uh, just, just yeah. me, I guess. It, it does start. say somewhere in the rules that events only affect the person who drew them. So, I could have done with that. Right. I'm going to rest. Yes. Yeah. Slacker. I know, right? <laughs> Such a slacker. So we lose <laughs> one supply. Ah. Uh, you refresh Four. three of your dice. Three dice. Because you've got six. Ooh. Okay. Let's go for a red. Okay, and so then you draw a section card. Let's go with that one. And that one. Draw a section card. Okay. Right. Second action. Uh, what was the action? 
car token. Just that, <laughs> that, that one. <laughs> oh, yeah. Did that take us down a um, yeah. Yeah. nine down to eight? And then I'm going to move. Which I'll make this one. All right. So this one is all dice all the way around. The A. Throwing caution to the wind. Yeah, just going for it now. I don't like losing dice. Yeah. Three, Three things like it. Oh, that's nice. Good news. Log 15. Log 15. The scans were correct. There are several interesting sites in this sector. Yeah. You're not wrong. Oh, that was it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Pink. Gotta wait for the pink. Find all three P113 cards, place a random one in this sector, and return the rest to points of interest card tray A. Right, so, so basically take one of the P113s okay. at random. And we need to do three cards here then. Essentially. Right, keep, maybe keep them out. One, two, or three. P113. Yeah, one, which one? One, two, or three. Or three. One. Is it... Okay. Reminder, this sector is fully explored only when you reveal a card with the flag icon. Buried signal. The mountain of charred rubble comes alive as a beacon-like sing <laughs> beacon -like signal sounds deep beneath it. Eat. Um, Put that on there. Let's have a look at it. Do, do, do. Do, there we go. So it's pickaxes. Yeah, it needs to dig because it's buried. But a gather icon progresses the. Yeah. Oh, there's no red. Yeah. Right. So you just do it. There's no danger. But yellow is doing it better. With it. To yellow is better for alien tech. Yeah. But there's no alien arrow. Two oh, alien tech leads. gain two alien tech leads and then progress the green track. By one. Yeah. So progressing the green track is what you need to do to get to Lord 22, right. but you okay. might come across some alien tech leads along the way. If you hit with a good PS. Yeah, and that okay. icon is... Uh, yeah. Hmm? What icon is that? Which one? This one? That one. Spiky... Spiky thing? Caves. 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 Digging into the cave. Right. Okay. Right then. Are you done? Event card. Ta. Caves and crystals. Uh, no, I'm going to either of them. So this moves on. Pink by one. Done. Oh, good, because otherwise I lost one. This event card one. system is quite nice. The fact that it's related to the Where terrain type, yeah. so mm -hmm. that they don't, yeah. so that they fit. Right. What am I doing? I'm down here on my own. Am I? Am I trying this? Can it does do cost it? us a supply. It sorry. It does cost us a success token, which mm -hmm. is in turn not going to allow us to but, level up. But yeah. But we can rest, therefore we can get more stuff. Perhaps we can. I, I, I'm, I'm thinking gonna, eight I'm supplies might rest. be enough. I'm going to need to rest. You're going to need to rest at least once. I'm, I'm going to need yeah. to rest when I go to here. Just three. And we've got the six. emergency broadcast system. But we've got that. We got that. I yeah, think we're in. I think we've got enough. enough. I don't yeah, think probably enough. I think it's just a waste. Mm. Move then. Yeah. Well, I, I did say I was going to prepare as my first action. You did. Hmm. I did. Try and roll some dice. Um, but no, I, <laughs> I think I will. I will travel first. I travel from here to here. I spend two dice to do that, and then we read log sixteen. You shouldn't have gone this way. Big gribblies. You die. <laughs> We're passing the ridge of solidified lava. Don't forget to gather samples. It may tell us something about the composition of the planet's core. It might be somehow related to this crystal. Wait, there's a whole field of antennae up ahead. They are humongous. Perfect place to scavenge some alien tech. Define humongous, away team. At least several times larger than our Earth's fast telescope. Diameters measured in kilometers. Gosh, that's big. That's very big. Place card P114 in this sector. Okay. Ultra large array. The for this forest of enormous antennae indicates this civilization tried to communicate with someone or something. Oh. Yeah. So we can computers. study the array. 
it, it's all about alien tech leads in this, uh, isn't it? Just yeah. And okay, we can get more successes. Mm -hmm. Right. So that was my first action. You moved. Yep. The move? I'm yeah. then going to use my adrenaline shot. Oh. So I'm going to roll the danger die. <clears throat> what letter? C. Okay. Ones, threes, and fours. One, we discard dice. Spend a die. Yeah, something. Ah, spend now, dice. I can't spend a die. Next. So whenever you have to spend a die and you can't spend a die, you have to sacrifice a dice. Mm. Oh. So I'm going to sacrifice that, which I believe goes back in my... Pop for the mission. Pop. Go. Mm -hmm. But then... But I now refresh all of my dice and return that to the armory. Okay. But... <laughs> because your med kit doesn't have a sleeve. There you go. That's back in the armory. So I refresh my dice. Right. Okay. So that's nice. So that wasn't an action. So I've still got a second action. Um, Ooh, I, well, could you not use the adrenaline shot first? I could have done, but then I, it refreshes all of my dice. Yeah, but then you could have spent one instead of burning it. Yeah, but I didn't know I was going to get that right. accident result. <laughs> Oh, I could have re-rolled the injury die. Never mind. Never mind. It's fine. Okay, so I could study the array. What do we need? We need that and that. I can I, help I, from far. But can you get those icons? I could do that one. Hmm. It means it needs a vanguard symbol. And I can spend one charge to choose a crew member assisting me ah. and turn a dice in your roll pool to any result. So we can get that. We can definitely get that. We okay. just need a vanguard. Now there's no bad, there's no bad stuff on this. Nope. So if I roll that, and I roll, roll it. this doesn't really matter, I don't think. Oh, hang on, what have we got here? I roll that. That's the three dice. Yep. That would be a blue and blue two others. So the worst case. So that's blue and green only. That's red, blue, and green. Red, blue, I think that's just blue, isn't it? Oh, the top thing looks green to me. Okay. Maybe. Maybe Things, blue. Yeah. <laughs> so w worst case, we get the green result. It'd yeah. just be nice if we got the other result as I well. I can re help re-roll blue or green. Okay. So we'll do that. But obviously not the blue. Not Except blue. I'm injured, so I've got to put that dice in as well. Yep. So this is the roll pool. It's not a dangerous... Nope. Right. Going to roll yours. I don't need to because you're going to turn it to the same side. Oh, I might. Oh, okay, let's roll it first. Yeah. So what have you? You've spent a charge to in order to assist me from anywhere. Yep. Because you've got like a telephone or something. I'm like poking at this planet. Uh. <laughs> oh well, there you go. <laughs> okay. So I have vanguarded. We've double vanguarded. Yeah. So modify the dice results. Don't need to check for dice combinations. So you've got green, green, or green snowflake. Nope. Can't do that. Still got danger. Can't do that. Right, okay. No dice combinations. Okay. Resolve the injury and danger dice. That does not match that. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to put it back there. Uh, special effects. We have no special effects. And then mark the outcomes. So I spend that vanguard, and you spend that vanguard, and we mark that result. Then we spend the remaining dice, and now we do that result. So we gain two alien tech leads. Right, okay, here we go. Just a good ones. It's got to be good ones. Yeah. <laughs> it's got to be good ones. You can exert at any time. Yes, there is that as well. You can exert uh, yeah, at any time. I about this. Sacrifice a dice and refresh five dice. Mm. But my adrenaline shot was like, mm. well, there, there was well, a we chance. We could do that instead of running out of supplies, couldn't we? Quite yeah, yeah, yeah. We could do if we need to. If we need to. Yeah. So how many am I drawing? Two. That's not an action. Well, there you go. Well, that's it. That's now, four now. Do we do we stop immediately before drawing the second one? That's that question. is the question. Let's have a look. Let's see what the rule book says. The rule book says, whenever instructed to gain one or more lead tokens, randomly draw them out of the bag and place them one by one in an order of your choice. On top of, on top the, of the corresponding discovery okay. dates. So draw another. I'll draw them one by one, or draw them both together. Draw, draw them, them out of the bag one. and place them one by one. So, so draw your yeah, draw two. them out of the bag. So a three and a two. Okay, mm. put the two on. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the two <laughs> yeah. on. Does it mean draw them and place them one by one or draw? It's, it's randomly draw them out of the bag. 
yes. and place them one by one in an order of your choice. So I've drawn them out of the bag. Yep. I am now going to put that one on there. And as soon as it gets to three or more, place all lead tokens on that deck by the side of the bag, apart from that one that goes back in. So I just put those three tokens face up nearby. And we get that card, I guess. And we get that card. So we found an and, alien take discovery. And plus no, that's no, when that's it was drawn. Yeah. So we found an ultra rare alien <gasps> tech. Ultra rare. Ultra rare. Ultra rare. Ultra rare. Wow. Uh, an alien Amazing. data vault. When you gain this discovery, you may flip an incomplete rank up <gasps> card to the completed side. What the? That's it. That's it. <laughs> Hold the phone. <laughs> that was a good discovery. Nice. Ultra rare. Yeah. <laughs> but then? Um, and then we put the three on it. And get another one. Which gets another one, which is super ultra mega, no, <laughs> uh, normal alien tech. Normal, okay. A plant-based generator. Uh, we do something when we unload it. So, now, we can only That's take five discoveries with five us. Things, yeah. You are not allowed to not take unique discoveries. Right. We have to take okay. those with yeah, us take those. and up to three so, more. One more in then. Okay. Awesome. Well, that went well. Nice. That was good. Uh, and then, gain a success token and replace this card with P115. It's already there. Ready to go. He's got it. Oh. The array control room. The mainframe controlling the array is too large to move and extremely complex. You decipher alien systems. If you have unique discovery three, we don't. We do. You may treat any snowflake result as an exobiology result. Okay. So any snowflakes or any exobiology moves the top. Any any basic snowflakes results count as <laughs> count cause xenology, and xenology will. Advance the green. Advance that track on. Right, okay. Nice. Uh, was that my two actions? Yeah. M I travelled, I did my adrenaline shot, and I did the, the thing. Yeah. So nice. it's an event card. Now, what have we got? Ruins and void. Void. Mm -hmm. Detached. <gasps> I have to sacrifice a dice. So that no. the, the icon oh. with the line through it, is sacrifice the dice or roll roll E then roll G. Oh What's the E other side G? of the card? Oh. E is two threes or fours, which is injury, injury, or then lob a dice, and G is loser equipment. I'm got one. Loser supply, gain a burn injury. Oh, I don't like any of those. But it could be nothing and nothing. But it could, <laughs> it could, but I think I'm going to sacrifice a die. Yeah, it's probably wise. Oh, do I want to sacrifice that? That's my good one. And is it good? Sacrifice one of these. So you sacrifice from your spent pool. I can sacrifice from anywhere, I think. Oh, but that's my only green dice, and I don't know if I'm going to need green dice. I've got three green dice. No, I've got three, three green dice. I'm, I'm going to lose that. Okay. That's two dice already. I know. Um, and that's it. I think we're done. Turn okay. Unavailable. I'm going to rest. So we lose. Supplies go down to seven. Yes, you found the alien tech. And then you got detached. Ah, yeah. flying away. Get him quick. Sacrifice. Move a section die from your available dice or spent pool back to your section compartment. Reducing the total number of dice your crew member has until the end of planetary exploration. You cannot do that if you have a total of three in play. So if I only had three in play mm -hmm. and I was told to sacrifice the dice, I would gain the exhausted injury instead. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> but now you do less when you rest as well because you've got less dice. I now only have four dice, so yes, I will only refresh two. Hmm. Um, do you want to kind of help dig up this? I'm going to move. I'm going to travel across here. I'm going to roll. Yep. What do I roll on? It's A. It's A, is it? One or two is a bad thing. Oops. Just lose a dice. Spend the dice. Spend the die. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's my go event. P. 
perilous overlook. Uh, caves yes. and crystalline. Yes, we yeah. match on crystals. Um, you may roll. You may roll a danger die to refresh hey. two dice. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm going to do that. What letter is it? A. A. So get one and two. One spiky bit. Spend a Spend dice. Spend a die. But then you get two back? I get two back. That's right. Well done. You spelunking. I believe that's the end of round two. Yep. Mm -hmm. Only round two. Round mm -hmm. two. We're doing well. Loads of happiness. Actually. <laughs> Okay. The action token goes over. Who's going to go first in round three? <clears throat> hmm. So. I've got, uh, got? pickaxes and I've got my danger dice. Which I'll probably be... If I, if I, if I were to uh, rest and travel... I'm then able to assist everything that goes on in here. Yeah, I was planning on doing that with your because I'll have the lots pickaxe. of dice and I've got um, a re-roll and a refresh. I'm not great at doing this because you need the xenology results. Any other result progresses the red track, uh, unless because you've got unique discovery three. So yeah, you can treat these. As That's what I'm saying. I don't have many basic icons. Because uh, right. you love them all. I've got four on that one. I could just roll this, but I'd be rolling one dice at a time. And you can only do it once a round, once a turn. Yeah, exactly. You could go here, see what's here. I could. Mm. So, do you want to do? Your well, I can stuff? do. That. I can, well, I can do that. So it can, then I can assist, can't I? Yeah. So I'll rest. Do loads. Yeah. Rest him. Okay. So rest. So we're sticking with the turn order as it is. Yeah. <laughs> we okay. Okay. <laughs> so, so you're going to rest. So, is, so, so the supplies go down to six. Six. Okay. Well, then That's where we started. You yeah. refresh. Refresh all my three. Dice. No, three of them. Three. A three. The Christmas um, dice that he's got there. Look. Yeah, he's got lots of dice here. Um, we want pickaxes. Well, the vanguards it doesn't really make too much difference to me. But Depends if you're going to be going down here. Because then you want the basic dice. Mm. Yeah. Um, this one and. What have I got to re any. Four dice is not many. I'll take. No. Actually, I'll take that one. Okay. And then draw a card. And draw a card. So that's your first action done. Yeah, lobby two dice as well yeah. get down here. Okay, I'm, going, jet packs I'm going to roll yeah. the, danger, the danger die. Do you need the red dice for that? Burn that line. So danger die. A is a. it? A. Yep. One and twos. One and twos. One's. One. Lose dice. So spend the dice. Yeah. Easy come, easy go. Probably. Blue. Yeah, you want to save a red for a jetpack. Yeah, yeah, I do. Okay. Okay. That's it on there. Event card. Yep. Caves and crystalline. Crystalline. Uh, mesmerized. Spend all dice of a chosen color, <laughs> at least one die, to refresh all dice of another chosen color. Great. <laughs> <laughs> Not totally good for not what you wanted to yeah. do. Oh. Yeah. Well, maybe, yeah. Yeah, only one uh, one wounded. But a lot of the injury dice that we're rolling, sorry, a lot of the danger dice we're rolling are causing us to spend dice. They are. Yeah, it's only two of eight which are wound. Okay. So we spend... Well, I think, think the jetpack might be good to go there. Because we don't really know what that's all about, do we? Oh, spend your greens to get the red back? Yeah. Spend both Super greens to get a red? I well, know it's. Spend a red to get a blue. Mm. Lose three greens. God, that's pretty rough. Then that's keeping your. That's keeping the big one. Yeah. <clears throat> you might be able to get something back with a card or something at some point. Yeah. Okay, all yeah. done. Um, right. Right, Andrew. Yeah, I was like, no, man. Anyway. <laughs> uh, let's try digging up the stuff then. Yeah. So, dice check. Yeah. How many dice do you want to spend? Two. You need the danger die as well. 
do. And does anybody else Danger A. want to assist? So do you need anybody else's assistance? Well, depends how lucky I get, I guess. But you want you want pickaxes, don't no, you? Let's go for the red as do well. Do you want do you want some dangerous do you want some danger dice? It was a dangerous dice rather than a danger well, dice. Well there's no there's nothing for accident right on accidents. So, so it's a good time to use the wilds. And I can use things from the pool for my Yeah, they're all in one yeah. tool. Also. Yeah. Do you want to use your pickaxe to die or save that one? Well, I was just thinking about what I'm going to do in my turn. So I've got some quite, I've got some cards that I can use to assist my own. Okay. But uh, I can I okay, could I use might my do danger. this and it will go. <laughs> well, I have to get all the way along. Yeah, you're but not going to get all the way. Five, isn't it? No, well, I'll, I'll sit tight. I think. Okay. Okay. okay so step. Ooh. Three, roll the dice. Step four, modify the die results. Right. So can I? Can I? You can play one card to I modify the die card. results. So I can. I can it's, it's, re-roll. I can re-roll. But the remember, dice. accidents are not bad. Yes. Um, they're not bad, but they don't help us. So if I roll okay. this again, I could end up with two more vanguards. Yep. So you're going to spend your card. So I spend this card to re-roll, re-roll this that. card. Yep. Uh, roll up this card. Re-roll the dice. And get two vanguards. Oh. Which is currently four vanguards. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Which gets us. It's. We'll do. All, mm, yeah. We'll plan yeah. that in a sec. Yeah. We want one more, don't we? So I could re-roll. Well, no, three. four vanguards. You only need. Th- you only need three to get that outcome. You can only get one outcome. No, but there's no arrow. Yeah. So. But then, oh, then you get so that. The, the three. Is gain two. Any million. more than three Tech pickaxes teams. is a waste. Except that you could use it to. Ah, uh, true. Yeah. 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 And these. Not that easy. Though, well, don't we want to? So don't we want to go to log twenty-two anyway? Yeah, there's no way because we want to advance this card. Yeah, but the only way of advancing on that track is by getting to there, which gives no. you one advance. No, 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 no. Any dice will advance that track. <laughs> Any dice whatsoever. We, if we got five vanguards, we could do this card. Oh, I see. Right. Uh, yeah, you could because you don't have to use the vanguard as a pickaxe. You can use it as um, the, the mission is to advance this beyond the it third is. card. Yeah. So if we do that, yeah, that includes one track. So doing two of them, or three of them, sorry, gets us two alien tech and then one lead on there. Sorry, this is this is a this is a card with tracks. So ignore the fight. I think I just said there can only be one outcome. That's yes. not true. You can advance both tracks at the same time. Right. So what are we going to achieve with what we've got? We've got four successes to only four vanguards, so four of the pickaxes. So we can go there, 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 and, there. There, and that would stop. And that would stop. So we gain that, which gets us one on there, and then the other one is going to go there. Or you use it for the global condition to get a mineral lead. Yeah, choices. Lots of choices. Mm. Okay, so one more thing I'm going to do is so I'm going to re roll a green. Nice. Go for it. That Come one. on. Come on, Andrew. This is my. Yeah, this is your super duper dice. Crazy dice. Oh, oh, I think we knocked there. the time token. We did. It was on three. Okay, so that didn't do anything. Any more modifying the results? No. Okay, so check for dice combinations. So I can use any dice to roll. Can't use accidents for dice combinations. <laughs> I can't use any dice. No. It's the only thing you can't use accidents for. This is A. Yeah. All right. I may have forgotten to mention that this afternoon. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, then. So that's that done, then. So are you doing that? Yeah, might as well. I guess. A mineral lead. This is closer to doing the mineral discovery as well. Okay. We're running out of So spend, spend the dice with the gathering icon. So you pop it in your spent. Uh-huh. Sorry. To gain a mineral lead. Mineral lead. Any dice can be spent on the green track, including the yeah. thing. Yeah. Which is going to be mineral lead. <gasps> but you draw one card. I'm going to have that card. Cause I just made my card. Okay. Right. Okay. Any other dice combinations? Because you can do that multiple times if you wanted to. But I don't think you do, do you? Because you want the three for the thing. Three for the thing. 
So um, resolve injury and danger dice. You have three spiky bits. I mean, we could get three and get two alien tech, or we can get three mineral leads instead of three two alien tech leads. <laughs> yeah, but it's two alien tech and progress the group uh, by one. Yeah, yeah. So right. in fact, it's exactly the same. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> It's just, do you want two mineral leads and move on the green track, or do you want two alien tech leads and advance on the We're green track? We're more likely to get the mineral discovery. We are. So I mean, you can, can do that. Let's go to the minerals. Okay. So you're going to spend another one, or oh. spend those two. They go... Oh, yeah. They go there. They go yours. Now, I'm just going to check the rules before you do that, because there is some rules on dice with two icons. I just want to check that we're doing this correctly. Because I remember rewriting this section three times and I can't remember what we settled on. So, dice with multiple icons. Uh, yeah, they're called expert dice. No. No, they're not. No, it's the double vanguard one. It's this. Wild oh, dice. Slightly different. Here we go. Dice with multiple icons. If the dice combination requires two of the same icon, these two dice could be spent to apply the effect. Or even just one die with two of the same icons. If the dice combination requires a defense and a gathering, this one die could be spent. So if a, if a result depicts two icons, each icon is depicted separately. Okay, so there's this. You may move the required dice to the unspent pool effect. This may be done multiple times using different, different dice, dice for each yeah. time you So I don't the think effect. the double V symbol can be used to do that twice. Okay. Don't you? Not from no. the first bit you no. read. Section dice combinations... You may apply the effect of more than... Uh, no. Global conditions. If you have icons in the roll pool that match the dice combination requirement on the current global condition card, we do. you may move the required dice to their owner's spent pool to apply the effect. This may be done multiple times using different, different dice for each time you apply the effect. Right, okay. Not 100% sure, because, yeah, this dice with multiple icons... I, I thought we wrote, like, half a page on this, but there's actually very little. Um, so you can't, you can't use... See what the chat says. If anybody in the chat knows, can can you spend a dice with two to do that to Vanguard us. icons to get the globally global, the global, the global condition dice combination twice? Because yeah. it, it only applies to a global bit, condition. It? And it says this may be done multiple times using, using different, different dice. dice for each time you apply the effect. I mean that that there says that's that, definitive. but that's for global. Which but, is what we do. But then we go on to dice with multiple icons, and it does say each icon is treated separately. Yeah, I'm not 100% sure. In my sure. reading, you cannot double up. You waste one of the icons. Yeah, that's that's what I thought. But then someone says, this feels like you should be able to do that. <laughs> <laughs> because it's a wild icon. And... Yeah. If the dice combination requires two of the same icon, these two dice could be spent to apply the effect. I mean, I could just get the two alien tech and be done with it. Yeah. I think for now, I think I'm going to rule that you cannot use two icons for two different effects. Okay. So my vanguard, your double vanguard, yep. gets us all the way along there. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Get a, a two alien two tech. Two alien, alien tech, and we start the green track. And then I'm going to use that to do the green track one more. So that then just does yep. the green track. Nice. Okay. So alien tech, we have <laughs> wow. that one again. And a two. two. Okay. okay. Yeah, that's not so bad. Right. Can you even do the global dice combination multiple times? Yes, you can. Within one dice check. Yep. No, it does say global conditions do may be done multiple times using different dice for each time you apply the effect. Yep. Specifically says that. Uh, that was one action. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I've got no dice left. So... Rest again. Okay, supplies go down to five. Because there's nothing else for me to do. Three dice back. Uh, you draw a card. Which I've got too many cards then. Uh, yeah, Jonathan says when resolving a special effect, each icon on a, a die is treated separately. It is therefore possible that one die resolves a special effect more than once. Ah, where was that, Jonathan? It's copying and pasting it from, from the PDF. Whereabouts on the PDF? Because <laughs> it is a special effect. Maybe it's in the special effect rules. Page 33. Page 33. Left. I'm here. Top left. Top left. If it's resolved, if it's two icons, each icon. Yeah, each icon. icon resi yeah, but the bit specifically about special effects. 
Same with loving a special effect. Yeah, I'm not sure where that text is. Resolving special effects. Move the dice with those icons to the spent pool and apply the effect once for each time the requirement is met. Resolving this isn't resolving a special effect though, is it? Sorry, no, it's not a special effect. It's a dice combination effect. Yeah, yeah dice combination effects. Page are thirty four. He says top left. different. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So dice with two icons. That's when resolving a special effect. This is not a special effect. Mm -hmm. It's a dice combination effect. And it doesn't say anything else. That's that previous. So it, when resolving a special effect, each icon on the die is treated separately. Yeah. It is therefore yeah. possible that like we had saved yeah. that. Yeah. Was two One, things. Yeah. Yeah. But when doing dice combinations, I don't think it is. I think the rules are says... different for dice combinations. Okay. Yep. So I think yep. we've played it correctly. Okay. 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 So that's my both actions. I'm going to red card. Here we go. Where am I? Caves. Yep, I'm in caves. Ooh, you lob a die and lose. I'll get. I'll get a wounded injury. I've, a te I've torn your my suit. Suit is torn. I've torn your suit. So wounded. gain a wounded, wounded. injury. There you go. I mean, the good thing <laughs> is with us drawing event cards that match the biomes, it means we're getting the primary effect and not the time tracks by one. Mm. Yes. Because what happens when that time track goes up? We replace that. We, we replace that with something else. We might not get the mining. Right, okay. But I can medkit a, a mineral leads. I think I can use this any time, can't I? Yeah. What is it? I'll save it. You or another crew member in your task lose a green to spend a green die. To get rid of an injury yeah. die. But I'll save it in case we're running really. Okay. So what am I doing? Is it an action to use it? I don't no. think so. Because I've already said that doing this is not good for me. Yeah, for a second. You're gonna do it. So, <laughs> with, well, I mean, I could do it with one die, but it seems a bit of a waste. Yeah. But there is log 250. I want to know what log 250 is. Well, jetpack. Mm, jetpack. Jetpack slugs you get down there. Because <laughs> that's not an action. Jet set willy. Is it? Oh, yeah, it says it counts yeah. as an action. So no, so. that is an action, is it? Right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I've got a five in six chance of getting at least I can one. help you. Okay. And have you got basic dice? Yeah. No. Uh, no. <laughs> no. No, I haven't. Well, you've got, got you've my, got double vanguard. I've got double vanguard. And there's no penalty for accidents. <clears throat> sure. If you want to. So I'm I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna try and decipher you're the using, alien systems. What dice are you using? The blue. I'm using that one. And I have to put that in. Because I'm what injured. Do we achieve? Just the log. It's gonna be a story based thing, isn't it? Because we're looking at the mm. antennas. Mm. Okay. And you've got to spend a charge to do that. Yep. I've got one left for our thing if we need it. Yeah. Uh, 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 that's not what we needed. Oh, no, you're right there. Right, so modified die results. Re oh, it's not green. even green. Re -roll red. You can reroll my green. I can. So I'm going to reroll that green. I can't even re-roll my own blue. Mm. Oh. Seriously? That wasn't really a roll, was it? <laughs> no, that was a... That was a I can a spend a charge to choose hand. Oh, you a can crew member assisting me and turn Sorry. one die in the roll pool to any result. Nice. nice so one. I will spend a charge to get you to turn that to a double vanguard symbol. Yeah, we should have done that earlier. I can't do anything about this. We should have done that before re-rolling. Yeah, yeah. Re -rolling. Thankfully, that doesn't apply to that. So that can go back there. But we get two things on the track. So we've got two vanguard icons, which means we advance that track twice. And then we'll track the bottom one. Which spends once. that. But then unfortunately I have to spend that die to advance the bottom track once. Yeah. Which okay. is yeah. hacking the not planet. good. Yeah. Um I'm then going to prepare. So prepare, draw one section card. Uh, and or make a dice check. I'm going to choose not to make a dice check. Mm -hmm. oh, I wanted a dice back. Hmm. No, it's not yeah, good. because you couldn't do a dice combination before that, could you? No. Yeah. Because it's just a warning. Oh, because you can't use it for him anyway. I think that's me. Done. So, event. 
Where am I? Void. Void. Oh, no, nothing matches. Yeah, void and ruins. No, this is this is quicksand. So if no icons match, time track goes up by one. Mm -hmm. Done. It's over halfway. Mm. Okay, this needs to be a little paper clip that hooks onto the page. <laughs> right, I think I'm going to do this with three dice. Look for buried signals. Yeah. So three dice, you have to add the danger die as well. Yeah, I'm sure if I dig deep enough, I'll find. Uh, I'll be able to listen to the radio. Yeah. Any assisting? I could assist. But if you're going for the green track, then any three dice will do it. Yeah. Green track, one, two, three. <coughs> one, two, three. Need yeah. Three, need three. But we could do with some more alien tech, though, couldn't we? Because we are... If you get two pickaxes, yeah. The chances of that have to be Vanguard. It's three. Well, you've got a pickaxe as well. Yeah, I can re-roll a red. It would need to be three, wouldn't it, to get yeah, the three. extra? Mm -hmm. Yeah, three. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mind you, I've oh, got a card that allows me to convert. If I play this, I can convert... I can move that too, and take the to mining discovery. <laughs> That's finding it. Okay. But we could do that after. Yep. Time, yeah. So, any additional dice? I think I think you're on your own. I can help with a card if need be. Okay. Oof. One pickaxe. What does that do? Well, right, modify yeah. the results first. Okay. If you want to modify any of your results, I can re-roll. So what is it? I, isn't it? Yeah. So that's going to be oh, lose, lose a dice. Okay. So Probably I could lose. assist with acrobatics during a dice check. Move one die from the roll pool to the owner's spent pool to turn the uh, to turn one other die to the basic. Well, the basic's not any good here, is it? Mm -hmm. It does give you another green. That's not going to help. Doesn't it? No. Because any dice progresses the green track anyway. What I'm thinking oh, of doing... Oh, yeah, okay. Not the, yeah, what I'm doesn't. thinking of doing is using... Mm -hmm. Can I use those two to progress on the bottom? You can. And then I can use that pickaxe to refresh two blue dice. Yes, because you want to want to do that, because you're about to... Have to spend a dice. The alternative is to use that pickaxe. Which will kill a dice. Here, here or, or here. there. Um, well, you do you want to lose a dice completely is the question. Yes, good point. So I think I will do that. I will advance. So any any modifying of dice? Yes. Um, no. Right. Step five, dice combinations. Which is what you're doing. Right, this one. Yeah. So you're going to spend that. that. To refresh two blues. Two blue. So that's dice combinations done. Yep. Then resolve the injury and the danger dice. That spend a dice. Spend a die. Die. So it might as well be that one. Then we resolve special effects. So you have two dice, which moves the green track on two spaces. Right, and then they get spent. That goes in there. Okay. That's my action. That's the end. Event. Uh, so Jonathan is digging through the rules and says you cannot use a single double symbol to pay for two different dice combo cards. Yeah, so I think okay. we, we yeah, played we okay it. Yeah, that. yeah, that's yeah. fine. We're yeah. okay with that. Yeah. So I've got one action left, which I think is going to have to be rest. Shall I do that thing now? I'll save it. Supplies are down to four. Why did we run out of supplies? We're auto ejected. I'm not sure, actually. We will die on the planet. There, there is something in the rule book about what happens when you run out of supplies. Shall you I read it? You can't rest. <laughs> Might be important. <laughs> you can restless. And we can <laughs> exertion though as well. I have to remember that. Yeah, we can do exertion, which is supplies. Lose time. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's what you do, surely. Is you, you use you, you use supplies exertion. for a bit and then yeah. use exertion. Current yeah. number of supplies is tracked on the supply track. Yeah. yeah. So when the, when supplies are nearly about to run out, we start exerting, and yeah. it costs us to die each time, but we get them all back. But we get them all yeah. back. Instead of yeah. half of them, we get them all back. Yeah. Yeah. The difference. yeah, yeah. So that's both of my actions done. Mm -hmm. Draw an event. Uh, have I got it's caves and crystals? No. Time progress time by one. Okay. It was a hurricane. There's not much wind on this. We're in so. the cave. Yeah. <laughs> Inside sharp. the cave. Okay. So that's my go. So that's we the, end, the end of the round. End of the round. Get these back. 
Right. Okay, I've got two dice left. I could do two dice to progress the green one too that progresses the card. Yeah, if there are no supplies, you cannot rest. Yeah, that's okay. it. Use an exertion instead. Yeah. yeah. If you run out of all your dice, <laughs> can never be uh, out of three. No. Okay, so we'll just carry on going. For so you look. get the exhaustion injuries, and if you get your fourth injury, yeah. uh, okay, evac. Okay. So what I can do is I can use my two last last two dice to guarantee that. Or you could leave that for us yeah, to do, one. and you could jetpack here. I'm not sure this does anything. This is just completely. There empty. is nothing there, Until and you there. won't read a log when you go there. So the only reason for doing that is to come is down to go here. there. Yeah. Because to help you with the with the log, but in order to get that, I mean, I have to rest first because yeah. I need a red to use. Well, let's get somebody else to go back. first then. Maybe. Yeah. I could complete that potentially and see what's coming up. And see what's coming up, and then decide whether to do it. Yeah, because there yeah. might be something else. Yeah. That we might need better. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So you're going to go first in round four, whatever round we're on. Right. And are we going to try and get some more alien tech leads or not? Do we want because we've got two alien tech? Do we want to get a mineral? We've only, yeah, we've only got space for one more discovery. Mm -hmm. So I think if you do your thing, I'm going to do my thing. So before or after action, move one lead token from any discovery deck to another. So move the two onto move the, the two onto the mineral discovery, and we therefore find it. Which means we get a mineral discovery. That one gets put back into the bag. And what have we found? What have we found? A superconducting compound. Ooh, superconductor. And we get some electricity. Yeah, some fancy stuff. Okay, okay, so. First action, uh, I'm going to, not very much difference really getting rid of this wound dice, but I suppose I could roll stuff. So I'm going to use my med kit, I think, well, I used to spend a green. Spend a green, to, yeah, it's not really worth it. It only gets rid of the die, it doesn't get rid of the card either. Okay. Uh, I'm going to try and do this test, roll on these two. But you, if, you got, if you got rid of the die, you wouldn't be rolling it each time, whereas otherwise you have to. Yeah, but it means you're spending a green to get yeah. rid of that. Return this card to the armory. And then I'll, I'll only need to roll one blue, don't I? Okay, so you're going to use the kit. doesn't have to be anything. And the dice is gone. Well, the card stays. Yeah, you've, you've patched up the wound. Mm -hmm. I can't roll that result anymore. Can no. I? Right, I'm going to try and do this, which is a danger. Anybody assisting you? Anything. You just literally need any one dice, don't you? Yeah. Anything. So, anything so will there's, do it. there's no there's need no for anybody to assist you. Yeah. I'll get another wounded injury. Oh, hang on. We got. Where was that? I think that was. I was on one. Uh, it was yeah. two, two. I think that was yeah. two and one. Two and one, yeah. Yeah. Need a dice tray. Um, <laughs> so, I gain another wounded injury. Which gives you. <laughs> just get some of my dice back. Okay. Okay. Ouch. You've reopened the old wound. Yeah, yeah you have. But we get to go to log 22. Three. Three, two. 22. Seems that science and security are the red shirts. <laughs> Vanguard, we are close to the signal source. Proceed with caution, away team. Our advisors have several conflicting opinions as to what this thing may be. Some insist it is a trap made to... We've got it. It's a satellite? Any ideas, Vanguard? It could have fallen from the sky. No, it's buried too deep. It seems the end of this planet was rather explosive. This piece of the crust must have impacted the satellite in the wake of the explosion. Good find, away team. Grab what you can and continue the mission. Hmm. Gain one alien tech discovery. Oh, so we just get, gain one. Gain one. No, no, no. Oh, yeah. Oh, so not a lead. No. An actual discovery. discovery. Which we're now full. Yeah. So, so rare alien tech. Oh, it's got to be better than the common alien Planetary tech. Planetary exploration, you may discard this card to place your crew member in the lander sector. Oh, well, there we go. So we can actually use that during, during this. this mission. Yeah. Okay. But is it maximum five coming? We can't even. No, no, no. In? Maximum five when we leave. Okay, cool. So at the moment they're all just piled up outside. <laughs> um, you see another interesting place in this area. Remove this card from the game and replace it with another P one one three, which is a medical wing. The ruined facility contains a bewildering plethora, plethora of organic remains and biological hazards. 
adequate protection is advised. Um, so we can inspect the remains. And if you have no shields in your roll pool, that's a event. Okay, I have shields. I am the shield man. I've got in, in my green snowflakes of shields. Wrong button. There you go. Okay, a bit Gosh, lacking it's quite shield. tough. Gain one live specimen discovery. Just that you get one of them. Yeah. Not not a lead. See so if you get a pickaxe and a thing. Two vanguards. Yeah. Okay. Oh, there's something in there. A live Game specimen that might attack specimen. you. Oh, that's oh, just specimen. too tasty. There's an alien like, in there. You can't, hurt you. can't pass that up. Uh, so I've got one extra left, but I've got... I got nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I is out of dash. Are you going to exert or are you going to rest? Ooh, exerting. That's a good fun thing to do, isn't it? Because exerting refreshes five dice. It does. I'm going to exert it, lock the blue. Yeah. Got to be the way. And that's not an that's action. That's not an action either. Now, I can't do this because I've already done one special action. You've already even done one special Even if it's a different Correct. card. Yeah. So I shall... You could prepare. Prepare. Yeah. Draw a card. Mm. So I've only got one card here. And do a dice check if you want to do a dice check. Or not. Hmm. Potentially, because this allows me to draw two more cards, which allows me to okay, so just roll find other dice. Things. But then, if it's an accident, I get naff. Yeah, and that means I've spent a dice as well. Mm hmm. Hmm. And it's a dice check, so you'd have to roll the injury die. Yeah, oh yeah. That. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Forget that. Have yeah. an event. Yeah. Uh, oh well, we are no longer in caves. We're now in ruins. Ruins. So crystalline crystal ruins. Crystalline which ruins. Which is good because the caves is was on it. So okay. Anymore. Time track goes up one. To get getting close. Clock. We could have gained supplies. Right, my go. Got two actions left. What am I doing? I'm not staying here, am I? Because this is. I need the xenology yeah. results. Or. Basic, yeah, but basic. the chance of me rolling basic on these is... I can help. It's, oh, you with your remote helping again. <laughs> yeah, it's my last charge. But then you can put it to any side. So again, we can go for the double vanguard, which allows us to succeed. Okay, I mean, that's, that seems good. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'm going to do the dice check mm -hmm. with no dice. Uh -huh. You're going to spend a charge one. to help me. That's my last charge, so we can't do that. All right, you emergency broadcast system anymore. Okay, yeah. But so you roll the dice. Oh no! And then I spend this to turn that to any result. Two, nice double vanguard, which we use as so. Yeah, none of this, none of that, none of that, none of that, none of that, none of that. Where's my cards? Could I have done anything? No. Um, so we progress that twice. And then we go to log 250. Nice, we're, yeah. we're a team. Yeah. Teamed up there. <laughs> Remotely. That's a remote, remote team. team. I had to log in. Yeah. <laughs> Research log 18C. The study of the array revealed the creatures of this planet made a significant effort to contact other civilizations. However, once they realized they were doomed, they tried to rewire this massive, complex form of a giant receiver into a giant transmitter. The message they tried to send is unfortunately impossible to recover. We can only wonder whether it was some sort of final testament, an admission of a great mistake, or a warning they hope to deliver to other civilizations. Another disconcerting find is that many terminals and devices here are designed to accommodate users of different shapes, sizes, and numbers of limbs. Even though this wasn't a space-faring civilization, and even though it used a single language, we must learn more about this place to form an opinion. Mm, gosh. Did they have lots of different races? Gain one success token and two alien tech leads. Yeah. And replace the POI in this sector with P000. That's your alien tech leads because you found them. Yep. Yeah. A one and a one. There you go. Okay. You cleared up that area. Yes. Yeah. Okay, so that was my first action. 
So my second action, I will travel. Do you want now, to um, it's spend a die or do that. I think I'm just going to spend a die. Okay. But there's nothing to see here. Nope. But there might be in the future. Yeah, there might be. I'm going to draw an event card. Where am I? Oh, there's no buying icons. Nothing. You're floating in space. So nothing matches. So Oops. all time tracks go up by one. Replace means card G02. We need G02. Uh -oh. The global conditions have changed. Two. Gamma flashes. Oof. The crystalline structure, structure begins to emit sudden gamma flashes. Should we take shelter? All dice checks gain the following special effect. Um... um Let's just pop it on here. Expl explanation mark. Two accidents. Two, two accidents equals a danger If we roll die. two accidents, we have to roll the danger die. I guess that means. Okay. Travelling has changed. So travelling now requires a dice check. And if you get yeah. red or blue... You can move. You move. If not, you have to lock two cards. If not, you have to spend two so dice. Spend two dice. And then you don't move? No, because oh, yeah, the, the arrow then up. means you do move. But two dice, you can, you're going to roll two dice anyway. Spend, no, you're going to spend a blue or a red to move. Yeah. And, hang on. How can you not succeed that? Roll agreed. If all you've got left yeah. is green. If all you've got left is green, then you, then yeah. Then you have to, yeah, but then you have to, dis, it doesn't make sense. If all you've got left is green, then don't blue. roll them. You have to discard two dice. You have to spend two dice. You can spend two dice instead of rolling a red yes. or a blue. Yes. Yeah. So you don't have to roll anything at any test <laughs> ever. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so you don't have to make a dice check. You have you to make do. a dice check, but you don't have to put any dice in to the dice check. Yes. Yeah, so you auto fail, which makes you to discard two dice. Spend two dice. Yeah. Yeah. Discard. Spend. Yeah. Okay. So whose goes that? Mine. That was my two things done, and that was my event done. Done, done. Mm -hmm. So we just need to get through here. Yep. I mean, that's what the mission is, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. That's the mission. Yeah. I've just gone here because, well, you know. You wanted to come this way. I need to lie down. Yeah. <laughs> it's all a bit. Well, let's have a go at that then. It's all a bit alien techy. So you need to have a shield in your pool. Well, or get a vanguard. If you have no shields in your pool, it auto goes to the red. It, it auto goes to the red. Which is gain an exhausted injury. And then, and then go, go, to go to log 32. 32. So you could do nothing. Gain exhausted injury and go to log 32. Yeah. Do the dice check, but don't don't put any dice You're basically in. basically exhausting yourself to go to log 32. Yeah, I think that's what that does. Yeah. I, I think I'll look for it. And Skycroft says, yeah, just roll no dice, get exhausted and succeed. If you get a shield... Uh, mining pick and an exobiology thing, you get the life specimen. Yeah, no it's pretty to hard do. to do. It is. Well, it's got to be worth a try. Might get. If you roll all your dice, obviously I've, I've we got can a double help. Vanguard. I get to re-roll any dice and re-roll a red. Yeah, go on. Let's, let's, let's try it. I can add dice to it. Do you want any assisting? Um. If you've got any shields. Well, I would mean, rather not, because if you don't get there, then, I can, man, then, I, can, I, can, I can then do it with these two dots. No, because no. it's a shield. I can then do the, the, I can do the green. I can, I can do the green with my, with my two dice, so I'm not going to assist in case you fail. Because well, I can I've guarantee got... to go to log 32. Well, so can I, because i got... Well, you can do that anyway, just by getting an exhausted injury. Yeah. <laughs> Anyone can guarantee to do it. So yeah, I mean, whatever yeah. happens, we're going to be going to log 32. It's just a question of whether we get these can three... Try. Uh, so... I've, I've unfortunately, this, I've used my double second, Is this the second or That's third? The second one? card. The second. So log thirty-two so will be the third, third card. card. Yeah. So we're not very far away from. No, no, succeeding. I think we're almost done. So that's, that's why I think it's worth giving it a go and seeing if we can get the extra. If you get a live specimen, I mean, that could yeah. be interesting. Okay. Well, right, I might as well give you a chance towards a vanguard. All right. Come on, vanguards. Uh, well, I'll use the red, actually. Lots and lots of lovely vanguards. No, warning, or accident, I should say. Uh, All right, step four, modify the results. I can re-roll. And we roll anything, we roll a red, so. Which is my double, but this one. 
I'm going to re-roll this one. Yeah, do that. And if you don't get the double vanguard, I'll re-roll it as well. Okay. Single oh, vanguard, which is enough to stop me getting exhausted injuries. Well, you can get the top one if oh, you need another shield, don't you? Because you need a pickaxe, and there's the bunch which you've got. What we haven't got is the shield. So I could try re-rolling. Well, no, you've got the shield. Where? Got the that, shield. that vanguard is, is going to be the shield. No, but that could be the exobiology. So, here's a ruling question. Mm. If you have no things in your pool, it's not spending it. No, you're not spending it. It's just saying you haven't oh. got any shield. So, here, so here, here's the ruling question. <laughs> that vanguard is a shield. Right? We've yeah. gone past the special effect. Now we go to the next bit, and it's it is no longer a shield, and mm. it's changing. Can the vanguard icon be used as <laughs> different things? I don't, I don't know I would have that. thought probably not. You'd probably say this is what it is on this roll. Oh, Paul is asking: Is the global condition a forced combo? Yes, it is. The, the global, the global condition, which is all got. dice checks gain the following special effect, and that has to be done before the other special effects. Oh, we haven't we got haven't any. Got, we haven't got that. Well, oh, we, no, have, we, we do. Got we do currently oh, we have do. two accidents. Let's just roll a thing. Okay. So, that's... well, we're, we're still in the modifying the result stage. Yeah. So I can I can roll a re-roll a dice. I could re-roll that red. But yeah. but I'd like to know what the ruling is on can the vanguard icon. Change. change what it is because this is a special one it says if you have no shields in your roll pool it's not spending them no so I'm wondering if it can be a shield and then be more well, and, then, and, and then, then, then what do you say about the Vanguard symbol it's a wild card yeah do you have to lock it in let's have a look what the Vanguard symbol says because it might say when spending um, wherever this is this icon can be used as any other icon from section dice. There we go. So it sounds like it, can it change. might be able to change. Yeah. I don't know. It's a wild card. I will ask the designers afterwards. I, I was hoping they might be able to join us tonight in the chat, but I don't think they are. Um, I'll, I'll ask them later. <laughs> it's if, an interesting point. It is It is an interesting one. Can, can the Vanguard icon... Be more than be, one. Be maybe. more than one. Home thing. rule. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we might we might have to. Well, we, let's do it. Let's say, yeah. yeah so we've done it. We've succeeded. It but you do have to roll that dice. Well, we've got the two accidents first. Yeah. So you, we're not modifying the two accidents. Unless you want to re roll that one. Oh, I could re roll that one. Yeah. I mean, we don't have to. Yeah. I mean, you haven't got any wounds. True. It's just. So it's that. probably okay. I can re well, re roll it. If I get another Vanguard, we, the point is moot. Mm -hmm. Yes, we'll be right. <laughs> yeah. It's not no, no, it's not. But you don't need to get the wound. But you don't have to roll the dice. Yeah. Okay, so check for dice combinations. That one we've passed. Any other dice combinations that we want to use with dice? It's only your it, cards. It's only basically. your cards if you've got any. No, I've used them. Okay. <laughs> Feels like cheating, but also too cool to not be allowed. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so we resolve the injury in the danger dice, none of that. So resolve the special effects. Yeah, we did do that. Mark the outcomes. So. Oh, no, the, the special effect is if you have no shields in your pool, go to the red effect. We're saying that that's a shield. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now we go then, to the next bit where we need a pickaxe and uh, an eyeball. And we've got a And we're saying card. that that's the pickaxe and we're saying that that's now an eyeball. Yeah, yeah. I mean, so you it makes spend sense. those two. So you spend those two dice. And we mark that outcome. Uh -huh. And then we spend all remaining dice. And then we resolve the outcome. Right. So we gain a live gain specimen. A live discovery. specimen. Uh oh. Here we go. Uh oh. It's oh. Don't bring it on board. Flickery cilia. A what? Oh. <laughs> Flickery <laughs> cilia. Uh, who, what, when? One of them, eh? I remember diving with something similar off, the, off Lundy. It's got, <laughs> the cilia means it's got little kind of. Arms that move to make it move. Uh, planetary explanation: mm. You may discard this card to gain two supplies. Oh, and get supplies back. So you can eat it. We can either take it home as a fantastic okay. specimen, or just stick it in the curry. Flickery cilia. I'm not eating yeah. any aliens. Thank you very much. <laughs> well, they, they, they we can't be. take it with us. So you so have to eat it then. I think we, I think that's what we're going to do. It's a guinea pig. Stick it in the microwave. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pass it round. So that that gets discarded. Mm. And we get two supplies. Mm. There you go. We've got loads of supplies oh, now. Nice. <laughs> the barbecue sauce went really and well. And we go it? to log 32. Voice log 13F. I'm entering the underground. 
The charred walls seem to absorb the light. Starting to regret that I went in alone. There are... remains here. Dozens of bodies in many strange shapes and sizes. It's bewildering and upsetting. I look over my shoulder and half expect one of them to move. Some cadavers show signs of major bionic and cybernetic modifications. They must all belong to different species. All surviving equipment seems adapted to various operators of different body shapes. How did so many intelligent species end up on one planet? We haven't found any proof that this was a space-faring civilization. I'm leaving this place. There's nothing more for me to see. But I have several questions for later. Did all these species evolve on this planet simultaneously? Or were they brought here somehow? How did they manage to live together peacefully? We should be on the lookout for more clues, especially something that could hold any pieces of their communication. Mm -hmm. Something's drawn them all here. You see another interesting place in this area. Remove this card from the game and replace it with another random P113. If there were no more P113, replace this card with P00. This is the last This P113. is the last one. Strip mines. Wide swathes of the planet's surface are covered with strip mines, overshadowed by the hulking, enormous machines. Mm, mining the surface. <clears throat> that was your first action or second action? That was my first action, but I've done my special action, so I can't do that. I can't explore this. Correct. But you card. could rest. I could rest, or I could. More supplies, didn't we? <clears throat> Well, I was thinking about, you know, I could rest. Yeah, I could rest. Uh, what am I going to need next time? Uh, I'm going to need vanguards and pickaxes. So let's um, let's rest. Yeah, thank you, Jonathan. We'll have to um, we'll we'll have to check with the designers on that one to see uh, to see what they say. Any other icon poses as if it were any other. Yeah. Icon. Okay. Um, the event, nothing happens. Oh, no okay. hazards. We're oh. making good progress in good time. Oh, nice. Just. <laughs> hey, good. Right, Paul, last okay. person for this round. Yep. So, uh, so I'm going to uh, scout the mines. Special action. Yep. Uh, I'm going to use just the two I've got left. So we need a red and a blue. We need red and blue. Um, yeah. But somebody could assist you somebody with the red, with and, red then, maybe. and then it's done. Um, yeah, well, I'll chip in with a red, and I can re-roll it. And this, uh, I use this just in case we get a vanguard. Yeah. Okay. Anybody yeah. chipping in? You're gonna have to. I can nice. chip in with the one that's got a double vanguard on it. Okay. Um, should I chip in with that one or this one? Well, we need a red and blue. Okay. Yeah, red, red. I can okay. re-roll that. Unfortunately, that, there's two uh, accidents. Two accidents. Not re-roll that beforehand. Yeah. <coughs> I can uh, move one. Modify the look. Move one else. from the roll pool to their own spent pool to return another to be a basic. I could re-roll that. So that's what you could do. You could return that green. So what, what did it say? No, to, to to turn another to the basic side. Yeah, yeah. I guess rid of this problem. So put that one back. Yeah, just just read the the first. Okay. Point. So during a dice check. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, move one from the roll pool. Mo one what? Dice. One dice. One so dice you can move color. that. I move that from the roll pool to their own spent pool. Yeah. To turn one other dice. Yeah. To the basic side. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's good. That that stops, stops that. that. Okay. There you go. Okay. And now you've got a red and a blue. Acrobatics. And now we've got a red and a blue, which, which is a green. Go to log nine. Go to log nine. So the only thing we didn't get is the three mineral leads. We didn't get the three mineral but, leads. You know, but, yeah, we can live with that. Right. What are we on log nine. And we're pretty much getting to the end. Yeah. Look at this. What were they digging for? Lime. The walls and piles contain mostly calcium oxide and calcium hydroxide. I guess they were making concrete. Enough concrete to fill a small sea. Mm. Okay. Mm. New objective. Find out what the concrete was used for. Oh, replace ooh. replace POI in sector six with card P one one six. There isn't a POI, but okay. Yeah, so card one one six appears there. Doomsday Sphere. Uh oh. Ah, uh, in here. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna put the camera on it. Yep. Yeah. Uh, replace mission card M twenty one with mission card M twenty two. 
That goes back in the deck then. Yeah, apparently. Um, the Doomsday Sphere, protected from seismic movements by an intricate system of giant springs and pistons, shielded with a thick shell of super hard alloy, the sphere must house something important. Oof. Mission, the final effort. You discover another exciting area. Remove this card from the game and replace it with another random P113, but if there are no more P113s, replace this with P000. The Mission the final effort. Wherever we go, we see signs of the massive construction effort this civilization undertook in its final weeks. But what were they building and where? The roads and transport systems point to an area not far from here. Find and unlock the doomsday sphere. So they locked something in there to keep it safe. Okay. The planet exploded, right, didn't they? Let's, uh, let's have a look at that then. So that's where we just found. So we can open the sphere. It requires that, that, or that to advance the green and accidents advance the red. So that's not too bad. Draw and resolve one event card and then do that. Okay, so it's going to happen. Yeah. There's no res resetting the track or anything. Yeah. So okay. we're going to open the okay. Doomsday Sphere. Yeah, I mean, right. what could go so, wrong? <laughs> so my second action then. I hit one red dice, Shane. No, but if I. Uh, We've if got I six supplies. Exhaust myself. If you wanted to rest. Well, I'm just thinking I might as well just get rid of one, mightn't I? And then I get. I get four back. Resting gets you to draw a card as well. Three and draw on a card. It does draw a card. Mm. Okay, yeah, resting it is then. Okay, so I'll have these two. We want so you're resting. Reds. So we go we yeah, six we down to five. Pickaxe. Vanguard. Three dice back Three and dice a card. Back. And a card. Done. Nice. And is that the end of the round? That's the. Yeah. yeah. Whose so is this? That, yeah. That's me done. That's what you rolled with that other test. So that's spent. That's yeah, spent. that was spent. Yeah, right, spent end of the round. Oh, event card. Turn your thing over, get an Turn event card. Get an event card. Okay, and well, we we are all, are we just in crystalline now? Yes. Is yeah. that all right? Yes. Oh. Does that okay. move the track backwards? Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay, so we're crystalline, uh, which means no icons match. Discard this card. Take all progress tracks by one. Okay. Time ticks on. Should this have started on the zero? No. Okay. Right, next round. Right, so we need to go to where? I can jetpack there, because I've now got a red dice. Can. So it's going to cost you one cost instead of one two dice to get instead there. Of two dice to get there. <coughs> um, I could do with resting. I mean, I could use two dice to get over. We're going to have to get there, aren't we? Shall I go out? last yeah. and wait for everybody else to get? Well, why don't you just jetpack in there? and then rest? I just jetpack in and then rest. Yeah, I've card. Yeah. But is it is it a good idea for Paul to go first if all he's doing is jetpacking and yeah, resting? Yeah, just resting. It's not well, I'm going to be doing is moving and resting. Probably we're all going to rest. Probably aren't we? I'll be, I'll be if we're there, there then we rest. can't assist one another, aren't we? We can't do anything on this 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 location anymore. Nope. So, what should I do this turn? You want to rest? Rest and, and then have a go at it. Prepare or well, rest and start it off. Yeah. Would it not make more sense for me to rest? Uh, for me, sorry. For, would it not make more sense for me to jetpack and rest, so that when you do your action, I'm there to assist you? Okay, or, which means Peter should yeah. go first. Rest, move. Rest, move. Rest, move. Bang. All does the go. Okay. <laughs> We're all there. To all help. does it all. Yeah. Off you yeah. go. Then. But then stuff stays because what I'm thinking of doing with two dice is moving. Yeah. Exerting. Oh, and then doing something. Then doing the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the lob of dice. Yeah, makes sense. Okay. So, moving. So, travelling. Which is spend two dice. Oh, do we still do that? It's not the... Uh... It, it's, yeah, it's, it's that, because it's, it's not that. Okay. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. So, spend two dice. Yep. Uh, exert. So, you sacrifice a die. Uh, sacrifice a die. To refresh five dice. To refresh five dice. And then have a crack. Right. Right. So, the sphere. fists and pickaxes. Physical and pickaxes and construction. And spanners. And spanners. You've got a spanner dice there. Yeah. So I might as well use all of them. Yeah, if you keep them on the side showing the markings, yeah. that tells you what that die it's is. Best that. Yeah. Yeah. So I might as well use all of them. As long as you don't run the one, the one in. Yeah. Warnings, accidents, accidents, accidents are bad. Warnings. So you don't want to roll the dice if it. Then again, there's vanguards. There he is. 
There's as much I, chance. And I can reroll. So there's no point in me adding my shield because that's a five in six chance that it'll be bad. Okay. No, and I can't help from anywhere anymore. You're not injured. It's not dangerous. Okay. Yeah. I'm just going to smash it. it. Sledgehammer. You're yeah. the yeah. 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 Very I've carefully, I've this with the pickaxe. Very carefully protected it from vibration. Send the engineer. <laughs> the pickaxe. So who's, got the, who's got the angle grinder? Yeah. Uh, okay. That's not looking too healthy. Whoa. But I have got... Oh, what's, what's that one? That's the one that's been expen that's been exhausted. That's been sent oh, that's back the one. to the yeah, that's the one that should be in the Oh, that's a shame. <laughs> Not look like a bad roll. Now, when do I get to re-roll? Is it before or after that? Before. before. Step four is modify the results. Let's re-roll. Let's re-roll that one. Using. It's well, it's got. Th well, if I re-roll this one, it's got three vanguards and three misses. Yeah. So shall I re shall I re-roll that one? You can use that. Is the card that says well, there's a 50 50. Whereas if you re roll that one, there's a five in six chance you won't get an accident. But you want a pickaxe as well, don't you? But you well, have what? you got a re roll of red? So, what am I most concerned about? Getting an accident or getting Vanguard? I think you want to re roll the red. Yeah. Well, only because really? well, there's a five in six chance that you'll be okay. Does it, does it matter that does it matter that you get injuries at this stage? Yeah, but it spends the dice. You're roll, re rolling it. It's the only. You only you need two of them to get that. If you re-roll the red, you you got five and six chance of not getting an accident. Mm. In which case you haven't got two, it means you don't have to roll that. All right. That's what that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. There we go. There we go. And pickaxe is one of the things you want as so well. We've done the modifying. Check for dice combinations. So sorry, that's a special effect. It's not a dice combination. Yeah. Any dice combinations no. that you want to use. Injury and danger dice, no. Special you effects. Help with the dice com you can't help with the dice combination. No. No. So special effects is that. No. No. Nope. Special effects is also this. <laughs> so we do that one first, then we do this one. So you spend any of those three icons to progress on the green track. So Just two. Spend that. And the spanner. And the spanner. Uh, oh, and the spanner. Yeah, I've got the yeah. spanner. So one, two. Yep. And then any accidents progress the red track. One. Mm -hmm. And I've got two dice left over. But you've got no cards. And, and, you, and then you spend those dice. That I can't use. So they go in there. Yeah. Okay. And that's what my both of my turns. So that's the end of my go. Yep. Event. event card. Uh, faint. Uh, what have we got here? We've got ruins and crystals. Crystals. Um, chasing. Uh, you haven't got crystals. You've got caves. Caves. Ruins. Sorry, that's what it is. I thought it was. That's the, okay. it's, it's a matching Cave, symbol. Caves ruins. It's yeah. a matching symbol, yeah. but I just misidentified it. Uh, faint clues. Chasing this lead will require a lot of work and equipment. You may pay one supplies to gain two leads of any type. Ooh, that's got to be tempting. Another alien tech, perhaps, or another two alien techs. Because all we need is one thing, and we get another alien tech. Mm -hmm. you I think we've got enough supplies. Go on then. So you play one supplies. Yeah. To draw two, two leads so of any type. Where's the bag? Under the iPad. I have the lead bag. Two of any type. So what are we starting with? Uh, we're an alien I tech. You only tech. need one more to to get two. Well, you two. can put them on here. Yeah. Then so draw put two. Them on draw two. Okay. There you go, none of these zeros. Look. Yeah. That's That's good. Good. Yeah. So the one goes on. One goes in there, get an alien tech. So one goes on there. That gives yeah. us three. And the yeah. two with the recycle symbols go back in the bag. Yeah. And the other two go down there. And then we so get that. So many discoveries. Uh, charred plating. Oof. During a planetary exploration, during dice check, you may place this card in the roll pool of any crew member in your sector, including yourself, Add shields or computers to the oh, roll pool shit. after the dice check. Discard this card. Okay. Well, we needed that earlier. Yeah, we did. Yeah. Okay. And then you got a two you can put on something. Well, no, we chose that it was alien tech discovery. Oh, did we? Okay. Yeah, I think that's how that works. Right. Because you draw them at the same time. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I think so. I'm not sure. Yeah. Two. So that's pretty, yeah. Done. And event card did, done. Did I do the event? What was that? That was the event. That was it. Yeah. Yeah. Got. Yeah. Got. Yeah. Okay. Action number one. 
Jetpack. So you spend a red die to move spend to a, a connected die. sector. Go to a connected sector. As an action. Okay. Is that the first time you've used your jetpack? Yeah. Yeah, that's the jetpack. Right. Okay, and uh, the next time I'm going to try to open the sphere. So I'm going with my dodgy Vanguard dice and. <laughs> Might cause it trouble. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, and okay. my bigger. I can get so, you to re roll the green one if needed. Yeah, I can re roll the red. So, all right. I'm not going to assist. Nobody's assisting me. I've got nothing. You've got nothing anyway. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Two so it's two successes. So that moves us up two, and that's it. One, two. two. Yeah, that's nice. Well, we didn't do that. There's none of that. None of that. Mm. Okay. They get spent. Right. That's got, they, they get spent. Okay, second action. Your first action was jetpacking. Second action was that. Second test. action was yeah. that, actually. So I've done that already. But did you want to exert now? Uh, so can I do got, that now? Yeah, so I just so? discuss. Yeah, then before I've got the something event. available for. Yeah, I've got yeah, something and available. And before my turn. And before the turn. Yeah, the big turn. So let's get rid of. <laughs> if it will even get the pool. Uh, yeah, let's I'm get, sure it will. Let's get these right. Oh, let's that's I'm really lucky. Yeah, I don't want to get rid of that one, really, do I? Let's get rid of a basic one, shall I? Okay. Okay. Refresh five dice. Refresh five dice. And then have an event. Nice. Thank you. And the event. Uh, we are in ruins, oh, caves. No, oh, so much. Uh, we match none of them. Ouch. Uh, well, increase the time track time by, by one. one. That's all right. Okay, okay, over to me. Yep. So, I'm going to spend two dice. Then I'm going to exert as well. Okay, so you sacrifice a die. And actually, let's keep let's get rid of that one and keep that one. Get all the other dice back, put them in the right places. Place them the right way. <laughs> uh, and then that's one action done. One action left. Are you going to try it? We only need one of those icons. Yeah. And I can assist with a re-roll. I can, I can, re-roll. I can re-roll green. I can re-roll red. Now this, I'm going to have to only roll two dice, aren't I, really? Right. Because if I roll the wound, I have to do You only do one of them. Two. I only do one of them. Yeah. Okay, so I can leave one dice. Mm-hmm. You'll be rolling the wound anyway. Yeah, I'm going to roll that. Yeah. But if I roll a thing, I need something to spend. Ah, oh, got it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Uh, I'll probably do that in a minute, don't I? Yeah. I'm just not going to mess up. No. I don't know where it was. It was on the first one. The first one. one. I think it was oh, the second, second one. Yeah, right. <laughs> I'm here. I'm here with my science and my DNA. Yeah, you got your science you. and DNA. <laughs> well is done, it, scientist. Is it going to help? No. No. In which case, then? So, modify the diary results. Yeah. Because that accident's bad. So, shall I? I'll get you to re roll the green dice. Okay, because okay. I can re-roll it as well. If need be. There. I'm okay. going to re-roll it as well. Okay. Yes. Better. Success. Okay. So we've Better. modified them. But, but first, now we do dice combinations. I've got no card to use them on. Resolve the injury dice. So that goes on there. You spend a die and then that goes back to wherever you want. Um, resolve the special effects. So we don't have two accidents, uh-huh. but we do have a something icon. So that goes there, and we don't do that. So spend the remaining dice. Nothing to spend it on. And then we get to log 240. 240. Somebody in the chat just said, had the set a die to any face skill? No, maybe pull. No. Oh, yeah, it's when you're being assisted. It's when I'm being assisted. Right, log 240. Captain's log, mm-hmm. entry D4. Seven. To the unknown creatures from the distant past in this distant world, I salute you. When our team finally began to crack the dome's inner layer, we expected a myriad of things. An ark, an archive, a vault, creating
created by the people of this world to carry their legacy beyond the apocalypse. Yet again, we were wrong. Inside, encased in protective carbon nanofoam, was an object as old as this planet. A steely that predated this civilization by millions of years. With their last dying effort, these creatures protected an artifact from an even older time, as resigned to the thought that all their history and culture, and even their very lives, were less important than this one cracked relic. I keep wondering whether humans would be capable of such sacrifice. The object they saved for us bears a clear resemblance to the architecture of the Eye of the Void. There's no doubt the builders who created the Eye and our star map also left this stone as they spread life to this planet. What does it mean for us? Are there other steelies like this on other planets? Was there one on Earth? The sides of the stell contain code we have yet to unravel, but atop it, we found one large symbol, alien yet familiar. A glyph that seems to symbolize uplifting, raising up, with several small dots scattered at its base. This last piece of the puzzle helped us understand some strange discoveries on this planet. The first evolved species here uplifted many other species through genetic engineering and bionic modifications, something that would never cross the minds of humans back on Earth. We will have plenty of time to ponder this and to study the steely on our journey to the next world. Let us hope this time we find more than just ashes. Mm. Bing. Mm -hmm. Congratulations, you have completed the mission. Discard mission card M22. Take. Discard. So, uh, no, it goes, it goes there. M22. Uh, move R06 research project from the research projects to the awaiting envelope. So back to our lovely R6. full awaiting envelope. We need R06, which is the builders, builders' landmark. That goes in there. Um, move the O02 objective bracket from Eon's past from bridge cards to the awaiting envelope. So it's in the bridge cards section. And what's it called? Uh, 002, which is called From Eons Past. Mm -hmm. Okay, that goes in there. Uh, on many planets, you must return to your lander after fulfilling your objective. Here, simply place all of your crew member models back in the lander sector. Okay, sure. It's like magic, it came picked us Bing. up. Um, remove the L1 landing card from the scanner, which is this. This should have been in the scanner. Uh, mm -hmm. Then remove it from the game. Another landing on this planet is not possible. Right. And then close. Right. How are we doing for time? Yeah, it's right. Just time. Half ten. Yeah. Do you want to do a bit more? Yeah. Progress through the ship book and see uh, see what happens when we get back. Because we didn't really see this earlier because it kind of uh, fast forwarded through things. So, Peter, you were in charge of the awaiting envelope, which is now absolutely full of goodies. <laughs> Right. What does it say to do? Well, wh which page did we finish on? We finished on page... Like in the leaving the planet. I beginning guess. planetary exploration. Mm -hmm. Which was there. So, leaving the planet. Okay. Let's put the rule book down. We don't need that. <coughs> Clean up components. Each crew member returns their section cards and section dice to their section compartment. Return all equipment cards from the planet board on the lander and any next to crew boards back to the armory. So all equipment cards that we didn't take with us or whatever, yeah, yep. they go back to the armory. Return any POI cards that have the no save icon well, back to points of interest. of interest. I don't think there are any. So all of the points of interest cards back? No, no, no. Return no. any POI cards that have that icon. Oh. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Return any POI cards that have an icon on. None of them have that icon on. Return any threat cards with that icon on to the box. Right. Return any optional missions to missions, which I think we've done. Return all lead tokens to the lead bag. 
Return all turn tokens, time tokens, equipment tokens, markers, crew member minis, the lander standee, start token, and all remaining dice to the box. So these go back into the bag as well, they cut the tokens that were there. Uh, the lead tokens yep. go back into the bag. And return all global condition cards back to global conditions. Mm. Right. Components check. Make sure that only the following components are left on the table. The planet board with all revealed POI cards that don't have the no save icon on, which is great. Any non-optional missions. So where was M23? Did it say to get rid of it? Okay. It did earlier, yeah. Uh, unclaimed unique discoveries. Threats that don't have the no save icon on. Decks of cards, which is the discovery deck, the event deck, and the injuries deck. Mm-hmm. Crew boards, crew member cards, and any injury cards. The lander board with its mods, gathered discoveries, unique discoveries, success tokens, and the rank up card. Okay? Right, so we've left the planet. You have to decide which of Yeah, I thought the there was a I thought there was a point where we had to choose Docking? Yeah, it should really be in light leaving the planet. You left it anyway, behind, sure. Docking. If there is at least one mission card on the planet board, no. nope. or there is a mission failed token on the lander, start at step one, which is mission failed. Uh-huh. So if right. we left and there was still a mission there, we failed. Now, discard excess discoveries. The total number of combined discoveries and unique discoveries is limited by the lander, so we can bring with us five. We cannot, uh, we, we've got to keep the unique discoveries, which is that one and that one, but out of those, we can keep three. Which ones do you want to keep? Well, some of them are only of any use to give us extra dice mm. on the planet. But then we can use them next time we go to a planet. True. If they're that good, we might want to think about it. I'm assuming this one, when you gain this card, you may flip an incomplete rank up card to complete the side. We don't need that anymore. We don't need that anymore. So we don't want that. We'll bin that one. I'm going to guess it goes back in there. We're going to want that one. Because when unloaded, you get an extra two energy, which is good. When unloaded, you may discard this card to draw a random strange flora discovery. Might be useful. And Have we not already done that? No, that's, no, that's when, when unloaded. Un- when unloaded. Oh. Uh, you may discard this card to place your crew member in the lander sector. So in our future missions, when you have to bounce back... I think get rid of that one. Get rid of that one. And this one, during dice check, you may... Oh, maybe get rid of that one. Because that's too complicated. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, they both discard. Yeah. I think get rid of the charge plating. Too complicated. We'll forget it. It's too complicated. Okay, go on. Right, okay. Assemble available crew members. So each player takes all crew members from the resting crew mm-hmm. and puts them into their hand. <laughs> yep. They're in my hand. No, no, no. no. <laughs> uh, the ones that are I have each my crew. person. So they are no longer resting. It's not resting. Okay. Kind of These are available crew members, so they go in your hand. Thank you. Um, oh yeah, I remember it. <laughs> debriefing. Right, <clears throat> debriefing. If the rank up card was flipped to the completed side during the latest planetary exploration, each crew member who was on the away team and is still alive checks to see if they meet the criteria shown on the rank up a number of success tokens based on their current rank. So we needed three success tokens if we were rank one to rank up, which we do. So, ding. I'm assuming they go in there. So, two. Uh, so we can rank up any of our... No, no, no. no, 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 no. The one who's on this the mission. One. Only the ones on the mission. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Goes fine. up from one to two. That's fine. After checking all crew members, if at least one of them gained a new rank... Remove the rank up card from the game. I've got one of yours. Okay, yeah. So that's gone. Yeah. If no crew members ranked up, return the card to rank ups. Okay, that's just promotion. Yeah, that's promotion. Um, next, create the success pool. Take all success tokens from the lander or the success token slot of the planet board. Add any success tokens from the bag. Success tokens from the bag. Yeah, so our success pool is now seven. Yep. Okay. 
Uh, and now buy or sell dice. So if we wanted to buy a dice, it would now cost us six because each section currently has six dice. Okay. Mm -hmm. I what think that's what success tokens are for. What else are we going to spend those on? I, yeah, I think that's what they're for. So should we do that? Yeah, yeah it makes so sense. One, two, three, four. And we can buy any dice we want now. Five, six. Yeah. Now because we might, we'll, we'll just remember that. But we would basically, we we could buy any one dice that we wanted to from there, and we we would add it to our our thing. Each player takes one section die from the box and adds it to their section compartment. If you have enough success tokens, you can buy more dice more during. So if we had like loads of success tokens, we could buy one, then another one. You can also sell dice to get success tokens back. How much they worth? Uh, you get four success tokens to the success pool. You can only do that once. So we've all bought a dice. We'll skip past it, but it seems a bit weird to sell so. a dice. Well, you get success tokens, which, which you can't use. I, for I don't know what they're Well, <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure. You can use next time around, maybe. Right. Page 28, unloading. <clears throat> Unload unique discoveries. So, in any order, resolve the when unloaded effect of any unique discoveries on the lander or in the found discovery slot of the planet board, which so is here. You choose discoveries for either their unloading benefit or your research product's requirements. You won't be able to bring them down to another planet. So, the. The, right, okay. That one, for example, won't be able to teleport us to another one. Right, okay. Oh, yeah, Skycroft is saying you can lose less advanced dice to buy better dice. So you get rid of the basic dice and improve oh, you them. Sell an old dice. Okay, so, yeah, 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 that makes yeah, sense. Yeah. Like debt so, what we're saying, we can. This one, we can't take this back in any again, order, unless we can use a mineral. So, this is unique discoveries. In any order, mm -hmm. resolve the when unloaded effect of any unique discoveries on the lander or in the found discovery slot of the planet board and move it to its corresponding slot here. So we have two and three, two unique discoveries. This says when unloaded. So we need research project R zero five into the away, into the awaiting envelope. And that goes there. Awaiting envelope. And that and that doesn't have a when unloaded effect. Okay. Okay. Next, gain bonus bridge upgrades if you fill a complete row of slots. Ooh, okay. You will get this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So as soon as we've got one, two, three, and four, we will get that bridge upgrade for free. Next, unload other discoveries. So in any order, resolve the when unloaded effect of any non-unique discoveries on the lander or in the founded discoveries, right? Then move these cards to gather discoveries. So that one, so I don't think we plant choose. based one. Yeah. So that doesn't have a when unloaded. This does. So when unloaded, you may discard this card to put two energy into the energy pool. Which we'd want to do. Yeah. I, I guess. Yeah, or we could, we spend well, energy, or we could keep it to be a mineral. Yes, but we, and we need minerals, minerals for something got? else. Well, no, we needed minerals for our ranking up, didn't we? We needed minerals for our but we also need research for... project, which is in there, I think. Yeah. Yes, I think well, that's, that's right. right. Yeah. But what do we? But energy sounds good. But the energy it wasn't we the energy, energy what we used stuff. for. Um, so should we do that? Go going to energy. going to the barracks and the production okay. stuff. So we're going to yeah. discard this mineral to gain two lightning bolts, two energy. Yeah. Right. Next. Uh, when unloaded, you may discard this card to draw one random strange flora discovery. Ooh. Should we do it? Yeah. yeah. See what they are. So we're going to get rid of the plant-based like generator. Rare one. <laughs> and inside the plant-based generator is a rare strange flora. Yeah. Okay. Now, this has been asked because this has got a when unloaded effect. Yeah. This is one of the questions that's been asked. So I'll be unloading it now. And I think the answer is no. No, you don't. Well, don't you? It's interesting. I would, I would think it yes. was. I'm, I'm going to read thought, the FAQ. Yeah, I thought yes. Because because we're, we're unloading a big thing. thing. Right. Right. No, no. A crate. And, and this, and in we, it. And we, well, we have found this. It has Was been this? asked. Yeah. It has been asked. <laughs> Do we want to put this on the vessel or not? <laughs> Throw it out the window. No. <laughs> Yeah, the, the reason we wanted the minerals was for the research project that gets improves lasers. Mm. Oh. Who needs lasers? Uh, don't know. We've got a danger sensing vine coming on board. I know, right? I mean, just which gets vine. us two stars in our command pool, which is what we want. Yeah. Uh, right. Where is it? Where is God, it? Where is good. it? Ship book. Here we go. Rest. If I gained a discovery during ship management, does it ship management effect trigger? And the answer is no. Unless otherwise stated, the when unloaded effects oh. only activate on page 28 of the ship book. Yeah, but we we're right. sentence. But we are. Discoveries gained during ship management. Are we in ship management? 
We are in ship management. This whole thing is ship management. Yeah. But only activate on page 28 ship, but we are on page 28. We are on page 28. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, so actually we've got a question that goes above the current question. Because we are yeah. we are gaining that discovery. We unpacked a crate and found. Yeah. And what, what, what does it say? Fine. It says... When unloaded... Ship management. When unloaded, you maybe discard this card to place two star tokens, power tokens. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, we'll go. We'll okay, go with what the work. FAQ says for the moment. Which if we is, got it later, I'd say no. But because, but because we're, because we're this, getting it right now, <laughs> yeah. I think thematically, we've opened up. It's just swapping one type of unload one for box. another. We've got yeah. this, and in this box, we choose to get rid of it to get two command tokens. Yeah. I can't see why that wouldn't be a problem. No. Well, but that's, that's what the card says to do. Yeah, I yeah. think so. That, but but the the official FAQ says, any time you gain a discovery during ship management. Well, we didn't gain it, the discovery it, during ship We did. Oh, this is ship the, This did whole we, thing is Did we is gain the discovery? Because we no, had a discovery. We, we gained the discovery. The discovery Florida. said, when unloaded, yeah. you may discard this to draw yeah. one random draw. strange flora yeah, discovery. Yeah, which is gaining so we, a discovery. So we gained the discovery during ship during management. During ship management. Yes. Right. That tells us we yeah. don't get to it. But the it. fact it says it only but activates on page 28 of the ship And we're on page 28. Which is the page we're on. I... It, it's worth that question. Is there a general rule that it's says worth, that the it's worth asking, can't yeah. text No, no rules. second yeah. effect. Yeah, it's worth asking that question again because yeah. that does seem a bit unusual. But that goes to gathered discoveries. Right, anyway. So where does that go? Does it go into a way? No, it goes to gathered discoveries in card trade B. So in card trade B, B. B. Yep, gathered what? discoveries. B. So that goes into our gathered discoveries along with that. Which so we those can use two, for stuff. yeah. Right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Then we store the lander. They're not gone. They can just be used. So for return the lander board to the box and put the lander mods into the awaiting envelope. Mm -hmm. We don't need that lander anymore. Parked it. Next, med bay. It doesn't trigger. Official answer from thirteen hours ago. Yeah, it's still weird. Still weird. Still weird. <laughs> Right, install med bay upgrades. Are there any med bay upgrades in the awaiting envelope? I don't think so, because so. we didn't put any in there. Release non-injured crew members. So any crew members from the awaiting that have no injuries yes. go into the resting crew. Oh, double okay. injured. Next, any crew members that are currently in med bay uh, move one slot to the right. Which there aren't any. And if we had any uh, cards, if we had any crew members in hand, we could assign them as therapists to heal other people. Which we do have crew members. Yeah, but there's no crew members currently in medbay. Isn't, isn't you about to go in, are you? But not yet. Yeah. Right, step four, right. injured crew members go to medbay. So place any injured but alive crew members from the away team into an empty medbay slot. So I've got one injury, which means I have light injuries. So I go here. I have two, injury, two injuries. So you've got moderate injuries, so you can go there. Anybody else injured? No. Right, okay. Each med bay oh, slot can only have one crew place. member in. Whenever an injured crew member is added to a med bay and all the slots are full, you go in one higher. If there is no such slot, the crew member dies. There's, there's no beds, <laughs> basically. Yeah. Um, now we make survival checks. Each crew member in a critical injury slot must make a survival check. Roll some dice, you might die. Mm. Next. Memorial Wall. <laughs> um, each dead crew member goes in here, and you actually get bonuses for putting them in here. Right. So the first time yeah. somebody dies. Yeah. Didn't that? Get sank at the wake. Mm. Is that you? That's me. That's you. I'm you're, on there. You dead. You're a ghost. Apparently. Oh. Oh. Right. Oh. Uh, <laughs> store the crew boards. So the crew boards are no longer needed at this point. Very cool. All right. They will they will disappear, uh, and then we go to the save point. So the, this is the most convenient time in the game to save. Uh -huh. And what you do is you record your current planet board. If the landing card that matches the name of your current planet was removed from the game, yes. don't bother because we can't come back there. So there's no point recording it. And then we save other cards and trays. So return all POI cards on the planet board back to points of interest. Return all unique discovery cards on the planet board back to unique discoveries. Fine. Place all available crew member cards in the awaiting envelope. So they go, they go in there. 
place the planetary Pretty scanner nice. in the awaiting envelope, wherever the planetary scanner is. It's over there. Uh, place any tokens from the success scan. Yeah, the command pool and the energy pools in the token bag, and then put the token bag. Guess where? <laughs> in the awaiting envelope. Best envelope. I hope it survives uh, a big campaign envelope. <laughs> Return any remaining POI cards that were next to the board back to points of interest. Close and store the Planetopedia. Shuffle, bit. Shuffle any discarded events back into the event deck and store them. Then return the Discoveries deck, the event deck and the injury deck to card tray A. Wounded card Close and store back. the ship book. And that's the save point. Right. And that is the end of the ship book. So the save point is at the end. And then if we start again, start again, and again, you resume a saved game, and it basically says, take certain stuff out. Take yep. the crew members out, put them back into your hand, etc. Et it's about getting rid of wounded cards. Injuries. Yeah, injuries. Oh, did it say to discard the wounded cards? Um, it, I, I think it did somewhere, and I might have misread it. Okay. But that's it. We're done. So we've played a full tutorial, and we've played a full extra thing, Can't and we we've got to the point... We there. Didn't move the no, so map. that that would be next. That would be the next. If we then did. played on now, we yeah. would plan to go somewhere else. We would start again. We'd resume the game. We'd take out all of the stuff. We'd go to the bridge. Yeah. Which means we'd resolve the homesick card. Right. Okay. Because the people were getting homesick. We didn't do anything about it. So that effect would happen. Then we'd generate our command and we'd yes. uh, energy pools. Yeah. Then we'd get a new situation. Um, oh, we'd get a new objective. Well. A the objective would replace that one because we have a new objective. Yeah. The tech level. We got we got tech level two, didn't we? We did. There is a t right, yeah. So take all bridge cards, which is objectives, secondary objectives, tech level, and bridge upgrade. So we take like tech level two out of there, and we put it here. Put it in there. We yeah. take the objective card, we put it there. So which means we've got slightly more light then. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then we would do the star map. Yeah. And we just remind ourselves where we were, we were here. So now all of a sudden we've got like five energy or six energy. And, we go to and at that energies. point, or we can do these things. So we could go there. Oh, boy. We could, oh careful. <laughs> we could literally go here, uh, which is just a bit of story. We don't know what's there. This, go here, sure leave, raise the morale. Mm, okay. Cost two energy. Might and then it. and then we'd go here. And basically we spend all of our what energy. What we can't do is go land again. We can't go there. Yeah, because the landing card does not exist, so we can't go there again. Yeah. So we fly around, and we'd probably go to another one of these places, which would be other pages in here. Um, and then if we don't end this step with a landing card in the planetary scanner, that's when we're adrift. So we choose somewhere else to go. We do all of that stuff. Then we do the ship facilities. So at this point, we do the production, the research. We may address the situation. We may go to the barracks. We may get more people. May not because we've got a couple of people. Plan something, and then we do all of the stuff, and then we yep. choose where to go. We choose a lander, etc., etc. Yep. Um, jolly well, yeah. So we've got loads of research projects in there. Yeah, yeah. I so would think we want to do that do next. Research lab, yeah. We want to start doing research, which requires icons on the on the cards that we have in hand. Mm. So we use our existing crew members in order to need some xenobiology people. I yeah, we've got any. Move these projects along. Um, we might not want to do production this time. But if we did, mm. that would move along one. But I don't know if we've got any other production projects in there, so we might no. we might skip that for a bit. Research situation. We, it depends research. what the new situation is. Yeah. Um, and then yeah, we choose a lander, choose the planet. Those those landing mod lander mods will go back in here, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and then we just mm -hmm. you just repeat. And yeah. You, and you keep repeating the process until the story ends. Until the end of the campaign. Mm. We're all done. <sighs> what time is it? Time for another 10 to guy. 11. Still the next 11. mission. That's about right, isn't it? We started at 8, so that's three hours. Yeah. 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 For, the for everything. For the for, for everything, pretty yeah. much. Yeah. So, four player game. Yeah, for a, for, for a four player game. It's quicker with fewer players. Yeah, it's not too bad, though, is it? Really? Yeah. yeah. You're nice. looking at probably two hours, I think. Um, two players. For two players. Although, you still have to do the same amount of stuff. So, in a two player yeah. game, you'd have. Yeah. You'd have to do twice as much stuff. I'd be interested to know if you've been playing this at one or two players. How long does it take you for a mm -hmm. for a game session? Don't have to talk so much, I guess. True, especially on a solo. 
Yeah, there's not as much as going, who's going first? Like, yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm going first. We did spend five minutes deciding who was going to go first in the round. Yeah. yeah. Um, that's it. We're all yeah, done. Cool. Um, so these videos today, hopefully, have helped you. I mean, first of all, I hope you've enjoyed them. If you've been watching the videos and you've enjoyed us getting into disastrous situations, um, but more importantly, I hope it's helped you learn how to play the game because it is a fairly complex game, even though the main rules are dice check. Mm. It's a 10-step process with a lot of things going on. Um, and as I say, I'll speak to the designers about that particular Vanguard icon because I do want to know what the answer to that is. And I'll put some Klingon subtitles on screen when I get an answer to that. Um, and I'm also going to double check about the when unloading. Yes. Even mm -hmm. though it was officially yeah. answered yeah. 13 hours ago, it, yes. it still doesn't seem right not, not quite if right. it happens at the same time. But yeah, I hope it's helped you, um, you know, understand a bit more how to play the game. And let us know how you're getting on. If you've played the game, depending on how far you've got through, leave me a comment. Let us know how you're getting on with it. Uh, and keep an eye on the official and unofficial FAQ over on BGG. Tony's doing a great job at combining all of the, uh, the questions that are being asked, getting answers, uh, and Awaken Realms are really keeping uh, keeping it up to date with, with getting answers to people. Which is good. Cool. Right, we're all done. Thank you again to all of my Patreon supporters for funding the channel. If you like the content that I create, obviously give the video a like, but consider supporting me at patreon.com forward slash gaming rules. I'll be back next week with some more content. I've got Undaunted Stalingrad to go live. I've got the monthly video log to go live. And next Friday, we're doing Hamlet, a village building game. So that's happening next week, as well as something else as well. I've lost track. There's too many things going on. But for now, we'll say goodnight. Thank you very much to you three for joining me today. No worries. Thank you. We'll see you all Bye. soon. Bye-bye.